Hello. I'm gonna turn the game down, don't worry. I know it's real loud. Hi, Yoli. How's the sound? I hope it's okay. It sounds better on my end. Hello, hello. Hello. So I got this game during the Steam sale because I really wanted it. Um, I It's like a collectioning game, like where you like solve puzzles to collect stuff. And you, if you know me, you know I love collecting stuff. Plus the art is just like chef's kiss. So good. So I figured, why not? I changed the theme, if you guys can tell, did, if you saw with, here, before we start the game, I can show, I can show it, um, you can see with the, the new followers and stuff, I have to keep this, this cam border, cause like, I just love it, although I did get cam borders that match the theme, um, as that, I also have, I have all that, and then this is the camera one. Um, I also changed the, the, you're all right. I also changed the, the Twitch banner. Um, oh goodness. But this gives me a chance to actually edit the chat so it's, fits where I want it to fit. Um, the only thing that sucks is it's white text against a white background. Hello, Rush. Hello, Yonder. Um... Uh, I need to come up with a good color. Hi, chicken. I need to come up with a good color that, like, actually... Hi, Crouch. Hello, everyone. Hello. Uh, I'm doing good. Hello, Kicks. Hi. I'm trying to figure out, does anyone have any color recommendations that will show up good on here and also on here? Because um, the white text looks great when I'm playing the game. However, when we're in webcam, oh, also, that's, an, that's another problem. You stream today? Nice. Nice. Congrats. I'm sorry. I, I know I saw Porto shout you out. I didn't get a chance to go and check it out because I had like a thousand things going on in today. Oh, baby, we got stories for today um, that we can talk about. All right, that'll just have to do for, for chat. Um, but yeah, I just don't know what color to do. But look how cute it is! I mean, it's not, like, you can't really see the text in chat, but it's cute! I feel like it suits me a lot more. It's less, like, cartoony. I don't know, I really like it. Um, and I love these. I love that. I love how it, like, moves and stuff. Um, and it was super cheap, so. Do we like it? Yes? No? Is the banner okay? Shout me out because I'm kind of joking about streaming. Didn't expect anyone to join. Dude, I would have I come. I'm sorry. I was so freaking busy today with chaos. It looks so you. Yay! I really like it. I really like it. Um, and I have made it. It also, I needed to make a new banner because rest in peace, Pisces. Passed away. New screens don't have voice set up. Oh, I know they don't. I don't have them set up for a reason. Because I don't want, like, people to hear me talking or making noises on my mic. Um, for, um, oh, not what I meant to do. That one. Um, for, like, the offline and the BRB. Because, like, I don't, I don't want to. Um, is the camera too small? I just realized how small the camera is. I'm sorry. I played with this so much yesterday. I wanted to do, um... Try using gray colored text. Okay. Try using text color. Okay. All right. All right. All right. One second. Let me move my cam border. I think that's better. I think it was too small before. Sling war zone. You wouldn't have wanted to be there. <laughs> Damn. You don't know. Hi, kids. I like it. Works well for the camera size. Okay. Love the new overview. It looks great. Yay! I really like, uh, I realize you guys can't see my, my mouse, but I really like the new follower everything. Um, 
Okay, so we just, what color did we say? Four six eight two four six. All right. Mm, oh, do we have the RGBA? I don't. That's what I have. Um, but I can't. What sucks is I can't do. I don't think I can do two different chat boxes. So I don't think I can do two different colors. Is this is this a problem for later? Let me know if this is a problem for later, because I wasn't even thinking of 70, 130, 70, okay. 70, 130, 70. Okay. Alright, talk and chat. It looks the same. Awesome. In a different team, right? No, because it uses the same source. It's the same chat box, no matter what. Um, yeah, it looks it looks no different. All right, I'll play with it later. We'll have to do a test stream where everyone's just like cool with just spamming chat, and we'll and we'll uh, we'll we'll handle it all. Hi, chicken. Hi, hi. Hello, hello. You have multiple. Okay, all right. We'll handle it later. We'll handle it later. For now, it looks good here. Even if it's a little small, yeah, because I don't like the size of this here. Whatever, let's play the game. Let's play the game. Claire, I gave you should be green. I'll Discord you. Okay, I wanted the green to match uh, this green, though. I want it to match the this green. This green. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Welcome to the Spirit Scouts. Before you head out on your first solo camping trip, fix yourself up. Oh, 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 I didn't know I got to customize my character. Hi, homie. I'm so excited. New game I haven't seen you play yet. No, I just got it. I just got it. Um, during the Steam sale. It's like a collection game. It looks super cute. Um, and it looks like a good cozy game, which I want to play more cozy games. Aw. Ah, it's so cute. Okay, I think this is this is the hairstyle. Dude, look at me. I'm so freaking cute. It's going to be fun. Yay! I'm glad you guys like it. Usually when I play indie games, I don't do it nearly as well. But I prefer playing them. I'll send Okay. All right. All right. Sounds good. You open the letter that carried on uh, the robot. It says, Dear Spirit Scout, welcome to the island of Cozy Grove. Utilities and other public services are not available on the island, so please check your provisions. Rangers from the mainland rarely visit the island. You'll need to be self-sufficient. Note that previous campers have reported run-ins with bears in the area, so use caution. It kind of reminds me of Don't Starve, but, like, happy and cute. Because Don't Starve is, like, death and destruction and scary monsters. Thank you, Yonder. Have fun and keep your fire burning. Spirit Scout motto. All those who are lost uh, deserve kindness. Aw. So sweet. Oh, dude, this is so don't starve. I love it. We got our fire. <laughs> how old, how are those, oh, wait. How old are those starter lugs? Scout tastes like a century at least. So where have you brought us this time? Uh, some place called Cozy Grove. Cozy Grove, I know that name. I've licked it off old brochures, tossed into my embers. This is so cute, I love it. I love it too. I sense dozens of wounded, restless spirits here, desperate for help, but not conscious of it. This doesn't seem like a, a, the sort of place young spirit scouts typically, typically go for their first solitary excursion. Yeah, it seems like a bad idea if to just send what is basically a young child girl scout out on her own. Ugh. Are you ready to see what's out there beyond my firelight? Uh, I think so. Okay, Yonder, have a good nap. I guess it's not really napping, it's more sleeping. I see, the ghost of a ranger at the edge of the woods. She's been waiting there for a long, long time. Don't be scared, Scout. Go introduce yourself. After all, you're here to help. I'm glad I'm, I feel good with my speaking today. I don't feel like lispy and whatnot. Fire seems brighter. Yes, ma'am. How do I set up the tent? What what type of sleep schedule do you have, God? Ah, uh, cute cube cube ghost bear. Cause I have responsibilities. Uh, you should sleep instead of ha doing those responsibilities. He's a cowboy. I'm a cowboy, baby. Huh? Another imaginary camper. Must have brewed my lady gray a little strong this morning. Unless say you're not a real living person, are you? Yes, I am. Ah, uh, 
I didn't even hear the little sound he makes when he talks. Well, I haven't heard the news. This exciting, uh, I haven't heard news this exciting since the baby warblers hatched. Welcome to Camp Cozy Grove. I'm Charlotte, your local ranger, also a ghost. If you run into any problems, I'm your bear. Say, that uniform of yours, it looks familiar. Oh, my, you're a spirit scout. That does change the forecast a bit. Puts the sun behind the clouds, so to speak. Why? Why is it bad that I'm a spirit cat scout? Uh, what do you have against spirit scouts? You're not the first spirit scout to visit this island. Many years ago, another ambitious youngster summoned a, a fire here is in hopes of earning her final merit badge. You're going to rip him from limb from limb from the other bear. What other bear are you talking about? I'm not going to. He's so cute. I'm not going to kill him. Oh, no. It did not go as planned. No use dwelling on the past, though, is there? You're here now, friend. She's not. Wait, was that an elephant? No, I think they were bears. If you're planning to stay, uh, stay the night, remember the first rule of the wilderness, wilderness survival. Keep warm. Somewhere around here is a wood log. Find it, toss it in the fire. That should make things a bit cozier for the, uh, for the both of us. Okay. So I have to find a piece of wood. Is that our first thing to find? This game has apparently a lot of just finding stuff, which I love. I mean, I do. I love collection games. I wouldn't have gotten it if it didn't say collection. No, you ripped the elephant apart? I, wh oh, the elephant, not the bear. Oh, it's literally right here. Are hidden on the ground. Well, no shit. I, I mean, it's literally right there. Here you go, my dude. Here's a log for you. Ah, he reminds me of Calcifer from from a uh, House Moving Castle. This is spirit wood. Oh god, I'm almost out of water. Where did you get this? Uh, a ghost told me about it. Well, first of all, thank you. It's delicious, but the presence of spirit wood confirms my suspicions. The haunting of Cozy Grove runs deep. There are many lost souls here in need of your help. Okay, Sin, I'll go get Basil. All right. Oh, I didn't even read what his last thing said. I was trying to pause the game. Oh, no. Okay, don't press escape. Don't press escape because I'm I'm skipping story. You earn a new badge. Log burner. Beginner. Okay. Ah. Oh, so cute. All right. Can I pause? Thank you. All right. All right. Hi, Astro. Okay, that's all right. Let me go grab Basil. Also, look at the cropping of the camera now. It doesn't, like, it's not square anymore because I finally fixed it. Hi, Bazooka. Yo, 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 what a dizzy. <laughs> Hope all is well. Do we like the look today? I wasn't wearing this before, but then I was playing a Stardew with people, and I got asked about a corset, and I'm like, I have this corset belt. I can show you how it works. And then I put it on, and I'm like, I look like a pirate. But, I mean, I could have it off as well. Because before I just had like my whole stomach hanging out, which I don't know. After just eating, I'm a little, I'm a little big. Oh, he's alive and not a ghost. Oh my god. Oh my god. We got the baby boy. We got him. I gotta scoot. Looking fancy tonight? Really? I was a little self-conscious with the amount of stomach I was showing, but I don't care. I went to the bank in it and I got some stairs, but also one of the people at the bank, not one of the workers, one of the people like there doing stuff, was like so covered in grease. Like it wasn't, we have a lot of homeless people in our town, which is fine. And, but it wasn't, like, the typical, like, just dirty, like, like, there's dirt on your skin. It was, like, just covered in grease. Like, it looked like he was a mechanic, but it was just everywhere. Like, on his face. Like, it looked like he was wearing eyeliner. So I feel like he had it on his hands and the sponge. Oh, my God, it was crazy. And I heard him talking to the, the bank teller and being like, oh, yeah, I work with, like, carbon or something, something. But I don't know. Anyways, here's Basil. Here's my little baby boy. Come on, show your face to the camera. Can you turn the light off? Is that what, what it requires to get Basil to boop the camera? Go boop the camera. No, not the monitor. Yeah. You gonna boop the camera. You gonna boop it. You gonna boop it. Boop. He booped it. Can I get a boop? Can I get a snoop boop? Thank you. 
Thank you, thank you. Don't go on my nose. Yeah, that tends to happen when you work with machinery. Yeah, but, like, it was nuts. It looked like he bathed in it. Like, I've seen people being covered in grease, and, like, I've seen mechanics, and I, I thought I had seen a lot. This guy, head to toe, grease. My night is going good. Um, it was pretty stressful today. Oh, I was going to talk about all the stories I have. Well, today was nuts. I was this close to canceling the stream. Luckily, my ibuprofen kicked in. Um, I had had a headache, like, right here all day like since I woke up and I was like oh today's gonna be chill like it's my one day off of work even though I, I'm playing Stardew and I have to like see a new addition or he's been around for a while oh Basil's been around for a while he's actually been around with the exception of my rest in peace ba uh, beta fish that just died um he's around he's been around the longest I got you back in December um my beta fish I got like a Two years ago so basil was strapped in the closet <laughs> he's put in there because uh, one it keeps the heat in because they want to be warm he has light um it's just not on right now um and usually um he has like we'll keep it open when it's on warmer days to let sunlight in um but one it keeps the heat in and then two like we're technically not supposed to have animals and of course i'm in an apartment you know, that's not supposed to have animals, and I over here have, you know, my zoo, um, and back when I set up his cage, I used to care about the whole not supposed to have animals, um, and before I realized that he, the apartment complex doesn't actually care, um, so he, that's why him and Mordecai are in the closet to hide them. That's why, that's why I'm a little baby boy. Hi, I just fed you yesterday. So he's all sweet right now. He gets a little pissy near feeding time. All right. I'm going to put my headphones back on. And you're going to hang out on him. Yeah, you know. You know the drill. He knows the drill. There you go, bud. I have a pop on my name now. What do you mean you have a pop on your name now? Oh, yes. Yeah, that's your sub thing. Were you, weren't you giving it a sub? Wait, who does Mordecai and how do I spell it? Mordecai is... Mordecai. Um, he is my leopard gecko. He's my leopard gecko. Slash Trevor's leopard gecko. Okay, so what do they want me to do? I, like, wasn't reading anything when, when I was too busy trying to save. Are you a, a ma'am or a sir? Ma'am, Charlotte. Oh, I was just thinking, this island is very haunted. Glad a spirit scout like yourself showed up. Oh, that's it. All right. Yeah, it gets up. Yeah, plant icons are adorable and creative. Why are you, why are you pointing to yourself? I don't see the option for the plant. Guys, you should. Mega swapped his founder badge for the plant. You should actually have like a full grown plant now. Hello, we got another spirit. Another bear? Excuse me. Let's point to the icons. That's what I figured. I thought they disappointed you and you were, uh, like in the closet. Oh, no, 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 no. They did not disappoint me. I do it mostly to keep them warm. Um, and then also to hide them. But it's not, I don't care about hiding them now. Because... I have a big ferret cage in the living room, so there's no point in hiding. And assuming they were a lady. I, their name's Charlotte. What? You should. I don't know how to swap it. Yonder, yonder did, not yonder, Mega did swap his from Founder. Oh, I guess you can see me. Oh, he has a little scuba suit. So sorry, I figured I'd be invisible. You're sorry for what? For haunting a perfectly good island. The last thing I want is to drift around for uh, the afterlight. Glowing blue, getting in the way of upstanding folk like yourself. Why are you assuming I'm upstanding? Also, we're taking off the corset because my tummy hurts from it. Ooh, ah, freedom. Freedom. It's unseemly. Until I find out what, uh, why I'm stuck here, I'm afraid I'll be haunting us both. Maybe I can make it up to you, maker buddy. Not to brag, but I'm pretty handy as a ghost to you. I thought I was going to say uh, handsy. I gotta go running off on four, five hours of sleep and I've got a date. Okay. Have a good night. Thanks for dropping by, Kicks. 
oh hiccups who's the blue cage in the background this is not a cage this is a fish tank um and my beta fish was in there before he gets sick and then i put him in the quarantine tank and he officially died um of his sickness yesterday bring me three branches okay i promise i'll make it worth your while i'm just gonna re what made him sick actually like sticks in the tank so i need to like take everything out of the tank um bleach it redo it and i want to redo it i don't really like how it looks right now um so before i do anything so it's gonna be months before a fish goes in there again well i guess i can turn my light back on since basil isn't trying to come okay we need to get branches we need three branches where do you where do we see some sticks so there's one stick dude this is i'm sorry i just it reminds me so so much of don't starve it just looks like a nicer version not nicer isn't better like nicer isn't oh sweeter cuter version of don't starve that's all this looks like hello why do you only have half a heart does that mean you have half a heart of love for me oh you're like dying i'm assuming it's the love part because i can't see anyone dying in this game i mean i guess they already are dead because they're they're ghosts you were beta fish yes morn's beta fish yes his name was pisces I had him for a couple years. He got sick because of the move. And I just, I could not help him. Because I couldn't figure out what he had until it was too late sort of thing. Hi, Porto. Baby's first don't starve. Yeah, that's what it feels like. Although, don't starve is a lot more vicious than this. Maybe not in the first season. But, God, once you get to winter and then summer. Whew. It's a, it's a difficult game. <laughs> Everyone's got to do their greenings. Hello, hello. Hello. I got sticks for Mr. Scuba Bear. Hello. Jeremy was your name? Look at these sticks. What beauties. A twist here, a scoop there, and voila! Your first shovel with three sticks. Not my finest work, but my paws keep slipping through the, the lathe. What is lathe? Uh, but if you want to dig up the soft dirt mounds around the island, that shovel should do the trick. Sea spirits, I've helped this poor scout. My haunting is complete. I'm still here, aren't I? Darn it. Darn it. One flimsy shovel isn't going to do it, is it? Of course not. Well, don't worry. I'm full of ideas for tools. I'll give you all the help you need to stay cozy in our grove. <laughs> okay, yonder. Have a good nap. Hope that shovel works out. Oh, and I have a spirit log, too. Thank you. Are these guys bad? Like, they look super cute. Hey, he's not a ghost anymore. I want to know if they're bad. Because they seem really cute. Oh, they must be. No, they're disappearing. Okay, we got we got Mr. Tool Man. He's not dead anymore, though, which is good. I mean, that's a start. You can't, I, does it, it's not counted as haunting, it was just hanging out and you're alive, right? What, you want your spirit log? Here's a log for you. Evil. Well done, my light is expanding again! I, I now see an old friend. Mr. Kit. Sorry, has, this is a lot of talking. Has noticed our beacon and uh, set up his canteen shop. Huh? He looks quite at home here. But wait, there's more. I see a strange and salty figure standing on the shore. And he as and he, as he has arrived, something else has vanished, something important. Oh dear. Best go see for yourself. Oh no. I'm going good. I'm on Fortnite with my bro. Bro, you play Fortnite? Nuts. I don't know why. I mean, actually, I'm sure it's fun, but I just would not. I was watching TV and then got a notification for a new follower on Twitch. Ooh, exciting, exciting. Do you stream? Am I following you? What's happening? I think I am following you. Uh, no, but now I am. There we are. All right. Look at these little leech dudes. Look at them. So cute. Hello. What do you got from here? Are you the fisherman? Oh, he said I could dig up stuff right now. Other games do you play? Porto Inside? I play Minecraft and Subnautica and Stardew, but not usually on stream. And I play Terraria. We haven't played in a little while because we're kind of at a slump in the game where it's we're like not good enough to beat the next boss. Um, I play like Animal Crossing and Pokemon on my own time. 
don't know. I don't know. And life. I was a bear. A uh, bear. Oh, the sea. Dude, he's a seagull. He's not a bear. What are you talking about? I, sp I sped from Cozy Grove to the main and back again. A hundred times over. Captain Bill Weather snout. Unnatural, some said, for a bear to fly. Twixt the waves as I did. Oh, he's pretending to be a bear. Thanks. And yes, I do stream. I stream Minecraft with my best friend. Cool. But did I listen? No, I did not. It's a seal bear thing. Oh, it's supposed to be a mermaid. What am I saying? It's supposed to be a mermaid bear. And now I am transformed. A vast young person. How long have you, uh, ye been standing there? Ye caught me reciting my origins. I'm Captain Bill Weather Snout, though some now call me the Seagull Bear. Pleased to meet you, Bill Weather. I don't know uh, as we've reached a first name basis, young sailor. <laughs> we called him Captain. Captain Bill Weather seems fine. I do want to ca call him Captain Snout. That sounds dumb. Captain will do. Tis a strange thing to be a seagull bear. My two halves uh, have precious little in common. Except, of course, for a love of fish. Speaking of, are you hungry, young sailor? God, I, it's it's the, like, piratey, the ye and your. Like, it's it's causing me to stutter. I was doing pretty good. Damn. Fetch me a fishing rod, and I'll show you what's on the menu. Oh, I thought I keep saying it on the side and thinking he gave me the fishing rod already. Got the bare necessities, the simple bare necessities. Sorry, I just got that that um that achievement that said bare necessities. It's okay. How do I? Where do I? Oh, here. Hi, Keen. This is Cozy Grove. It's like a collecting game. Um. But it reminds me a lot of Don't Starve, but baby version. Hello, what do you, why do you have an exclamation point? How do I, can I help you with something? Yes. Sometimes you can find things on this island simply by exploring it with a keen eye. But other times you need to get your hands dirty. Have you ever noticed those leaf piles lying around? Is it like this? Try digging through those when you come across them. You'll be surprised what you find. Just the other day I saw an old, a book peeking out of the leaves. Ah, that's what you want, is a, a book. Are these the leaves? I don't know what leaves he, they're talking about. Oh my god, look at this fox! <gasps> He's so cute! Oh my god, how do I... Why, hello there, Mr. Kit! I gotta go work. Okay, bye, Sin! Have a good day! Well, hello there, prospective shopper. I must confess, when I followed your fire, I never expected to end up here again. Okay, why is this is, is place so bad? People think, people are scaring me with how bad they make it seem. The island's fallen into quite a state since my last visit. But how rude of me. I haven't properly introduced myself. You may call me Mr. Kit. I know your name, of course, but I'm too far too polite to repeat it. I have a standing agreement with the Spirit Scouts, you know. Wherever you go, Kit's Canteen shall be there for you in all your buying and selling needs. The only catch, I set the prices. You want to buy something? Take a look at my shiny new stuff. What we got? Oh, night. Sorry. Sorry. Good luck. Where do you work? I guess it doesn't, it's a bad time to ask, given that. You can buy a fishing rod at the merchant. Oh! I'll say it's a, probably a bad time to ask, given that you're already leaving. Sounds great. Take my money. I need it anyways for the other dude. Okay, I also need to find this guy a book. I don't know what leaf piles he's talking about, though. Are these guys bad or no? That's the question. That is the question. Here's your here's your fishing rod, sir. Aye, sailor. That will do. That will do nicely. Well, what are you waiting for? If you want to find this proper meal, we're going to have to pluck it from the deep sea yourself. God. Install a new stuff for Chick-fil-A and travel a lot. Whoa. Whoa. Fancy. That, I, I still don't even understand what that job is, but that's pretty cool. Take the rod and catch us a whopper, a whooper. I'm assuming it's whopper because that's how the candy is spelled. Oh, dude, that's not a seagull bear. That's just straight up a seagull. What are you, what are you talking about? Okay, can I just, like, fish? Does it matter... Hold in hand. How do I... How do I cast it? Throw a bobber into water in front of fish. Oh, you have to see a fish. What do you... What? Oh! Okay, 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 okay. It's like Animal Crossing. You have to throw it at the actual fish. 
I see. That was too far. Oh no! Shit, I didn't know they turned around. What do you want now? Arr, suppose, uh, you want some fishing lessons then? Yes, that would have been nice er earlier. It's waiting for the cleaners to finish. Are you on your phone or something? <laughs> Very well. Select your fishing rod. Hold it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, they want a catfish. Haha, -ha, funny. God, I fucked it. Where, where are the other fish? That was the only fish I saw. I'm like, whatever Chick-fil-A wants done. I put new menus, heating stuff, new tech and fryers. Oh, okay. All right. That makes sense. Chilling on the app. Cool. Cool. Cool, cool. I'm glad it's working for you because I know the app is, uh, Annoying for certain people, including myself. Okay, is this too far? I can't really tell from here. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah. So like Animal Crossing, do I do it on three? Actually, no, it's not three. That's Pokemon. What is what is on three? Another game of some kind. Ah, it looks like a goldfish. Long nose ling. Dude, do they have like accurate fish fish in this? App really works. I yeah, that's. That's more to be what ex what I expect. Nothing blight. Welcome to the stream. We're fishing. Seahorse. Long neck eel. Excuse me? That ain't no eel, man. Also, this doesn't look like a ling either. What? I only use the app. Well, it's good it works for you. At least I'm assuming it does if it's all you use. You did not. Welcome, Savad. Welcome to the stream. We're playing. Oh, we got a catfish. And Ebony. Okay, so they are they are just random ass names. We got a catfish. Welcome, everyone. Yes. Yes. Welcome, everyone. This is a, a collecting game. Um, where... I a fine fin. You've managed to dredge up there. Good eating. I think uh, ye, ye and I have plenty of time for fishing. God, it's so hard. Now that your boat's washed out to sea. My boat did what? Oh my god, I have hair in my eye. Oh yes, a loose knot and a fickle tide was all it took to send your vessel in the, it's, on its merry way back to Neptune's bosom. Isn't bosom this? Not your ass? Does Neptune have, like, Neptune, the male god, have boobs? Currently in Ohio, I've been raining a lot. I'm so freaking jealous. I want rain so bad. I want it to be 65 cloudy and rainy. Again, please. That's all I want. I'm in Oregon. That's what I expected. And I don't get it. Don't blame yourself. The island's maelstrom. Um, maelstrom? Hmm. Of ill fortunes churned by, uh, by our wretches... Tales of ghostly woe. Fuck. I feel like I'm reading poetry. Bosom is... is <laughs> Until we spirits find a measure of peace, none may leave this place. So, young sailor, though uh, you're, you're a living scout and I'm a ghost, we have something in common. Yeah, we're both stranded. Yep. We're both stranded here on Cozy Grove. That doesn't seem very cozy, then. Whatever plans you had of solving our ghostly problems in, in a single evening, put them out of your mind. We bears aren't, aren't your overnight project anymore. We're your neighbors. Squawk, you're not a bear then. Oh, he's a little, he's a little like turnip dude. Oh, I got hiccups. Oh no, I can feel it. Nice. I like the cut of your jib. Your mizzen stay sail. However, it needs a bit of work if you ask me. Don't feel bad. We all need a bit of work, don't we? What does that mean? What is my mizzen? Dude, I don't understand this guy's language. Not gonna lie. Sorry, I'm just, my hair is, my bangs are getting so long that they're just constantly in my eyes and I'm just curling them to like make them go higher and just hoping to get used to them being in my eyes. One old coin. Oh, are they not gold? I thought it said gold coin. Okay, so I need to find the book um, for in the leaf piles that I still don't know what they are. Can I dig you? No. I just don't know what leaf piles they're talking about. All right, what you want? Here's a log for you. Oh, I got another one. 
Delicious! We should build my tent. Hmm, that's strange. I'm still hungry. I think one more spirit log should do it, though. I sense at least three logs out there. Maybe close, maybe far. Hmm, your appetite is growing. You're getting greedy, I see. Oh. Can I dig somewhere finally? Oh, no, I thought I, I, thought I could for a second. What leaf piles are you talking about, Charlotte? What do you... What leaf piles? What do you... Where are they? What do you want? About that. Try digging through leaf piles. Check your quest log for a hint. If you really stop, can get, come and get directions. What? What leaf log? Leaf, leaf, whatever the fuck. Oh, there. Okay. Ooh, a mushroom and a stick. No, no, nothing. All right. So that's what we're talking about, I guess. Rock. Harvest. Oh, no. I need a special tool. Oh, let's go sell those fish to the kit guy. Maybe he can give us something good for him. Oh, what? Oh, I thought he was blocked off for a second. I want to sell stuff. Let's sell you. Yes, take my eel seahorse. Also, take my gold, what looks like a goldfish. Yes. I want to buy new clothes. That's expensive. Oh, oh, it shows me. Oh, that's cute. <gasps> yes. All right, I want the bandana. That's our first goal. The mask is pretty damn cute, too. That one's pretty cute too. I think the I think the bandana is our first goal though. Oh, the little fire one's cute too. Ugh. Okay, so I don't. Do you want anything? I was just thinking. Hey, maker buddy. You know, the other day I heard two carpenters in that old um in that age old debate: Phillips or Flathead. Me? Well, I hate to make someone else on a project you just use a screwdriver that they don't like. Like, just keep both. It's like I can feel their displeasure with every twist of the screw. I personally think uh Phillips is better. Start the email look again. Well, that would require parting my hair over, like like all the way over here. Even though my hair. Honestly, still naturally wants to go this way. Oh, dude. Hold up. Hold up. How emo are we going? I, I gotta I gotta do a lot more work to it, but... Oh, that just looks like... De I look like Debbie Ryan. There we go. Almost. With the snake on my head, too? I just gotta fully move the part, though. Oh, my God. It feels so much like back when I had my emo bangs. Dude. Babe. Trevor. Yeah. Look. Throwback. Dude. Yes. Should I leave my hair like this? Do I go full emo for a little bit just for the stream? It's even doing what my hair used to do. I just, it needs to be a little bit longer and then I can properly go over my, over my, my, uh, right eye. I'm for it. It's honestly so much more comfortable because this is how my hair like naturally wants to go. Because for what, like seven years I had it like this. I don't know. It's, it's such a different look. What if we go the, ugh, this looks better though. I'm sorry. I like both, but this just feels more mature. So I'm happy to use either. Well, that was it? That was all you have for me? I, can't you build me a pickaxe or something to break that that thing? I love how I'm already stuck and I already don't know where to find this woman's book. Where? Where? Is there going to be someone on the beach? To check my journal for... Um, for a hint or whatever. I totally saw one near a skull. So f so close I can taste it. It's probably be under a leaf pile. Near a skull? It would match the emote? Well, no. Matching the emote would be doing like this. But then also like pushing my hair back. Because that, that emote is when I, with my, my hair that I got before my bangs that I physically can't even do now because I have bangs. 
I've, I've looked into possibly buying emotes to match my new hair, but I don't know if I want to spend the like $10 when it's just, it's just a simple hair change. And it, honestly, I think the emotes look better with this hair than my new hair. Okay, so you said it's near a skull. Sorry. Also, Sin, I thought you were like going to work. Okay, well this is a this is a dirt pile. I don't know what skull they're talking about. Ooh, money baby. Money money. I don't know what skull they're talking about. Let me know if you guys see a skull, because I certainly don't. Okay, okay, you're not gonna go in the chair. Uh-uh, we're not gonna go in the chair. So we'll still wait and the people leave. Ah. Okay. Alright. What time is it where you are? Oh, oh, this looks like a skull. I don't see a leaf pile though. This looks just like a skull. Bruh. I probably be under a leaf pile. Okay, I'm looking and I see no leaf pile. It also doesn't help that they aren't very clear on what a leaf pile looks like, but that's Definitely a skull. Maybe there's another skull. Co 14. And you're already. Okay. It seems kind of a weird. Like, you'd think they'd go in the early morning to do. Uh... Oh, so cute. To do um, maintenance and stuff. Okay, do we see any other skulls? Because apparently that one wasn't good enough. Can I get more help? Please. About that. Yes. Okay. Get hidden object directions. 100 coins. I don't have that much. Try it right when they close and sometimes go all night. Do, do they close at midnight? I thought they close at like 10 or like 9. Hey, bud. You want to go in the shirt? You're kind of cold. You want to go in the shirt? No, thanks. That's too expensive. I don't have that kind of money. Dude, I don't want to like have to look up shit for this game already. Like I know it's a searching game to find hidden objects, but like this feels less like hidden objects and like they're being unclear on what I'm actually looking for. Near a skull. That's the fucking skull. So where Guys, do I just look it up? I feel this sucks. I feel like I should just look it up. Is that not- that's a tree. Anything? Nope. Okay, alright. I think we're just gonna look it up, guys. Cause this is sucking and I feel soon. The close of time, but I already did two other swords. Oh! Okay, that makes more sense. Alright, so Cozy Grove. This is lame. I'm sorry. Walk through. I want to do this as little as possible. Uh, uh, oh, I just found out that this requires passing a real time to get through. Wow. Okay. That's, that's going to be hard to stream. Huh. So that's why it's nighttime because it's nighttime in real life. Okay. So it's always going to be night if I'm ever streaming this, which kind of sucks. Well, that doesn't really help me find it because it's not like an actual shit. I don't. What do you want from me? What do you want from me? All right, dude. What do I do next? Seek out the troubled seafarer on the beach. I already did that. I'll go see him again, though, if that's what you want me to do, since I can't find his his book. Hey, 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 hey! We don't go on the desk. That's how I lose you. And also, it's hard to stream Warframe. What is Warframe? I was hungry. I loved running. Did you know you can sprint? You hold the shift key? No, I didn't. Well, that's pretty nice. What would you like to do? Would you like a hug? I really needed that. Oh. 
Yes, I want to hug you. Oh my god, I can just keep hugging him? Is that it? Is that is that really it? No, don't leave. You guys are so cute. Wait, I can pick this up right. Ooh. God, this is like Animal Crossing. I don't know what you want from me. I don't know what to find. I said someone has a log and they're eager. Yes, I know. Oh, 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 oh. This is another hole. That's not a leaf thing, but it's a hole. We got a potato. Ninja game. It's like Elder Scrolls kind of. See, I don't even know what Elder Scrolls is like. Like, I know I know what it is. I just don't even know what game it is. I got max rank and I lost the will to play it. I guess you have nothing motivating you. No improvement motivating you anymore. Bruh. Bruh. What if I look it up? This specific wilderness guide. Cozy Grove wilderness guide cozy grove wilderness guide uh, uh oh wait as you can see she gives you the hints you need to know oh okay look at the photo was in probably under leaf piles actually is there but you have to progress a bit through the story and explore more Oh my goodness. This area is to the left of the dude. So it changes depending upon who you are. I just okay, what is it? Cozy Grove Leaf Leaf Pile. Can I just see what it looks like? Just just give me an idea of what it looks like. Okay, now I know what it looks like. Now it looks like actually like a pile of leaves in, in a... Don't starve. So he said it was by the skull. Saw one near a skull. So close, I can taste it. It's probably under a leaf pile. Okay, well, if she's right here and it's close, let's just start by looking around her. And maybe, maybe that'll help. That's not a leaf pile, even though it looks... Like, doesn't this look like a leaf pile to you? It looks like a leaf pile to me. Hmm. <laughs> but yeah, I was going to say I had stories from today. Yes, today was quite stressful. I had... This morning I had, like, a school thing that I didn't even know I had, which I'm also ended up telling me how much I'm actually going to be spending on school. And I'm like, why am I going to school? Like, why? Like, why am I spending this amount of money on schooling? It just feels, it feels ridiculous. It's like, you're, I, I'm just losing money. It's not a win-win situation. It's a lose, it's a lose-lose situation, it feels like. Um, I feel like I'm just following the masses and being a sheep by going to school. Um, because it's so expensive. So I'm all stressed about that, and, like, I'm trying to figure out student loans. Then I had to go to the bank, which I never like going to the bank. And then I ended up having, uh, my, uh, I'm not going to say much more than this, but I ended up having, uh, talking to my lawyer about stuff, which was stressful in itself. I did nothing wrong. Don't worry, guys, but just stuff happened and it is making me stressed, even though I shouldn't be stressed, but it's stress. This game is complex AF. So I'm lost in my own home. How did you get lost in your own home, 54? And welcome to the stream. I want to be able to... This game is complex AF. It is. It reminds me of... Uh, I expected it to be much simpler than this. It reminds me of uh, Animal Crossing. Can I get the tr the fruit on this, on this tree? Ah! Wait, a stick and that's it? It didn't even give me the fruit? A oh, pink, pink paw paw. Fruit capitalists are hard at work breeding irradiated pawpaws with shelf like drive cereal. Great, great, great. So, I don't know what to do, guys. I don't know what to do. I don't. Sure, I'm over it. I, I don't know what to do. 
I have the money. If it's not by a fucking skull, I'm gonna lose my goddamn mind. So it's down here. Bro! How did I not see this? What a waste of 100 coins. <sighs> well, that sucks. I guess I can always fish and get more, right? I mean, that seems like a good way to get money. Um, is by fishing and selling the fish to the fox guy. Alright, here's your stupid fucking wilderness guide, man. That wasn't by a skull at all. That's it. Why, it's an old spirit scout wilderness guide. Hey, the memento collection portion of this book is still intact. That's where the scouts track their progress, helping local spirits. Which I have to admit, you've gotten pretty good a start on. I'll, I'll hold on to this book and use it to track your progress, helping the spirits in Cozy Grove. Would you like to look at the memento collection book now? Sure, let's see how cute it is. That's it, the spirit. That's the spirit. Here it is. Oh, that's it? Wait, okay, I can see individual though. Okay. I don't really know what I'm looking at. Oh, it's the, the progress, the, the items I found. Cool. Thank you for the log, ma'am. Let me give it to Calcifer over here. Here's the log. You good now? Ah, another healthy dose of positive spirit energy. You're doing well, young scout. The more you help these ghosts, the more they will remember. It may go slowly at first, but trust and understanding is not a thing you can manufacture quick. Manufacture quickly. Did I pop my leg out of place uh, at work last night? Now I'm crippled. What? Like your knee popped out? Because I have that all the time. Well, not anymore, but before I started seeing like a physical therapist and stuff, my knee would pop out of socket. Like it was because of um, um, disharmony. Um, I. It was fucked up when I was born, basically. Also, I'm sorry. I'm so tired of fucking with my hair. I need to just go get it cut, dude. I just want to get a cut on a day off, and I don't have those till this weekend. It may go slowly at first, but trust and understanding. It, um, trust and understanding is not a thing that you can manufacture quickly. Help these bears, guide them through the remembering of themselves. Eventually, they will find peace. Peace. Man, I thought I was doing good about talking. Your knee so dude, I'm sorry. I have danger noodle hold on to it. <laughs> I don't I don't think he'll be much help. Dude, I'm sorry. I know that fucks you up, especially for I'm surprised it, it's lasting you more than a day. Usually I would only be like super sore for the rest of the day. And then the next day it'd be somewhat back to normal. But you must have really popped it out then. Ah, my light shines further, illuminates lost corners of time. I see another figure, absorbed with finding and uh, delivering lost things to everyone but himself. You two have that in common, I think. The fire seems brighter. You are now scout rank four. Nice, nice, nice. Can I help you with something? You know, we aren't the only spirits that could use your help. Sometimes lost or needy animals visit these woods. Wait, so what differs the animals from you as an animal? I mean, I've been working on it and putting weight on it so it hasn't had time to cover. Oh, yeah, that's true. You, Yeah, that makes sense. You, Why didn't you call out a work, dude? That You could get, like, workman's comp and stuff if you really ne need to, if they, like, if it gets worse. In fact, I think one wandered into Mr. Kit's shop just this morning. I'm, it may look like a simple charm of a young, placid bird. If you buy and bring it to me, I'll show you its secrets. Oh, I need so much money because I just spent all my money on you, woman. Ooh, yes. Can you give me money? Nope. I got a rock. A rock! Oh, it's three cores. I mean, that is a rock. How can I help you, cube bear? I can really take a sick day in my house because uh, my house is in Arizona and I'm in Ohio. But, like, you're staying somewhere. Like, you're staying in a in a hotel, I'm assuming. So just stay, take a sick day and stay in the hotel. Patrice Furback, the postal bear at your disposal. You know, I was going to say it doesn't look like a bear, but I just realized its ears are covered. You know, when I joined the service, I figured it, I'd be in it for, for life. And I was. But I never suspected the job would keep going after. <laughs> Let me tell you, delivering mail to ghosts, that's a whole new bag. To a whole new mailbag. <sighs> I'm stubborn, dang it. You should take a sick day. If your knee's really fucked up. I don't want you to get it worse. I'm already thinking myself that I'm going to have to get knee replacement in my left knee. Because that's the worst one, eventually. 
my whole left leg's fucked up. Like, I have, like, I'm, like, developing plantar fasciitis in my left foot and everything. Oh, my God. Ooh, bust out the postal humor from the jump. You and I will get along just fine. Before I went boots up, my work had a certain routine. Deliveries for local residents arrived at the town post office at, oh, at 08 sh- 0800 Sharp. God, why? I relayed on I relayed those deliveries to the listed residencies. Ghost deliveries, though, they're processed through the psychic plane. They just show up when, wherever and whenever they want to. I ran patrol this morning looking for new arrivals. But I bet a spirit log there uh, are more packages out there waiting to be tracked down. They may have lost it uh, by a supply shelf behind something. Okay. Well, I'm going to start. I'm going to go see what whoever over here wants, too. And then I will help find that for you, ma'am. Patrice. Can I help you with something? Hey there, maker buddy. I'm pre- pretty sure I owe you an apology. Uh, pretty sure you don't. I had to say it, but you're wrong. But you're wrong. Oh, he's so sad. He just constantly wants to apologize. Also, I realize he's not a scuba bear. He's a measuring tape. When it was in black and white, it looks like scuba goggles. <gasps> Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, excuse me. And a snorkel. I had to say it, but you're wrong. You're wrong. I made you that slip shot shovel earlier, uh, hoping a good deed would get me off of being a ghost. Of course, it hasn't worked out, but maybe because the shovel I gave you, it's not my best work. Let me show you what I mean. First, though, I'm going to need some softwood, root vegetables, and wood branches. Well, I have root vegetables. Oh, I need one more. All right. I got lots of stuff to get. So... I need another potato. Uh, I need more branches. You're behind something and you have to buy. Well, buying is going to be a real bitch. Do we see any things to dig over here? I think I'm going to grab this fish while I'm here. Just because, like, I need the money more than anything. That's mostly the reason. And this way I can sell it to Mr. Kit. Oh, I'm not even holding it. Hold my hand. Uh, there. Excuse me, Mr. Fishy. Can I have you please and sell you to a fox who's probably going to eat you? What we got. Oh, that's dead. Oh, dear gar. Oh, a dead gar. What they think fish look like in this game is whack. A chill wind blows ashore. Ghost that I am, it blows clean through me, sending a shiver through my bones, my very soul. A few more feathers under my coat might soften that breeze a bit. Too bad I just molted. Go exploring. Look. Look by a tarp? Look by a tarp, you say? Well, I see a tarp. Oh, that's probably just a towel, not a tarp. Okay, let's bring out the shovel again so we can dig stuff up. Oh, actually, let's grab you first. What we got? Boop. What weird fish are they going to give me this time? I didn't mean to do it back that far. I don't even understand how how it works in fishing. Like, how they do the projectiles. Catfish! I had an incident on Halloween. I sliced my knuckle through my bone. Put electrical tape in a glove and finish my work. Dude, again, workman's comp, bro. Workman's comp. Why don't you do it? Why don't you take it? They could be paying you. You wouldn't have to go to work. Doesn't that sound nice? Or are you just crazy and you just want to work constantly? Okay, we're looking for feathers. Or you're looking for things to dig up. We're looking for a box and some sticks and some potatoes. I think is the full list of things we're looking for. Oh, there's a feather. Nice. Oh, it makes sense being by the nest. Oh, let's get you guys. Who's who's gonna who's gonna take it? Probably the one that's is closer to. Yep. My schedule's a bit tight, and I need them all the money I can get. Again, if you're on workman's comp, they will pay you because they're because you hurt yourself on the job. Like you, you'll still get money, dude. Don't worry. Is this a new game? Yes, it is. Welcome, little saber. This is Cozy Grove. It's a collection game. It's very similar to Animal Crossing um, in that, like, time passes as if it's real time and whatnot. 
right now I'm fishing to get some money um, to go buy this guy, which I need for a quest. There's a lot of fish. If only Animal Crossing fish were this easy to, to come by. God. Got a long nose ling. Oh god. Oh, we're not. God, and you don't. You can be that far too, and they'll come close to it. God damn. We got another dead gar. Cool. It seems very chill. Yes. It's kind of annoying though, because like they aren't very clear on like what things look like. So they're like, go find this, and then I'm like, I have no idea what I'm looking for, and I had to look up. Uh, on Google a picture of it to understand what I'm even looking for. So, let's go. So we need feathers. We're looking for things to dig. It not I? What do you mean it not I? Meaning you're not chill? What? Oh, it's nothing. Never mind. I thought that was something I could pick up. This looks like something I can dig. Ooh, baby! Look at all that. So, we, did we get all the root vegetables? What? We're still at two out of three. Are you kidding me? Whack. Here's another feather, though, which is good. I'm gonna be honest, I zoned out. Did you say what devices? I can play Cozy Grove on? Uh, I did not, but I know you can play it on PC and Switch. Um, I don't really know anything else, though. Mostly just because I don't play anything else. So I don't really pay pay attention to when people talk about, like, games for PlayStation and Xbox. But definitely PC and Switch, for sure. I actually typed cool. Seems very chill. Instead of cool, it seems very chill. Oh. Oh. I did not read that. Shows how much I pay attention to chat. I always joke with Yonder about how... Well, rather, he jokes with me about how difficult people don't realize. People don't realize how difficult it can be to like read chat while playing a game, even if this is a real cozy game. Okay, thank you. Yeah, yeah. This this game, I think I would actually enjoy more on Switch, only because it is a time-based game, so I can just like bring my Switch around with me with like Animal Crossing. Um, rather than having to sit down on my computer at all times of the day. All right, let's go. How many feathers do we need? Three, two more. All right, two more, um, and then you're behind something by a supply shelf, and then I need one more branch and one more root vegetable. Okay, so let's go sell those fish at the very least as a start, so we can get some money and hopefully be able to buy the bird charm thing. I'm gonna buy something. How much are you? Two hundred and fifty dollars. That's pretty whack, dude. Hey, bud, not on the chair. Nah. -uh. Do you need to go back in your cage? It's okay. Everyone is everyone zoning out with this game. You can. Do people not? Is this not entertaining? Fifty-two coins just for for four. That seems kind of cheap, dude. Not gonna lie. I feel kind of gypped. Dude, that's gonna take forever. We're gonna do lots of fishing. No, I'm a war zone. That's alright. That's alright. I might put Basil back because he's deciding he wants to go on the chair. Looks cute and cool. Uh, I'm glad you like it. I'm always hesitant to play um, indie games. No! Sell! Please. That's the only reason, though. You're all good. You're all good. I'm gonna go put Basil back in his cage. Everyone say goodnight to Basil. Everyone say goodnight to Basil. Cause he's being annoying. Good night, my baby boy. All right, I will be right back. Guys, I don't want is that because of the game or anything like that. Okay. Good night, Danger Noodle. I'm gonna take my shoes off. They're starting to hurt my feet. Demonias are very cute. And I like the amount of height that they give me. But God, they have no arch support or anything. It's just straight flat. It isn't even like soft inside. Like it feels like I'm walking on the, you know, 
six inches of rubber that I am. Like, you know, but it's not, it's not, they're not exactly the comfiest shoes, but they're also not really meant to be walked in, not gonna lie. And I'm not walking outside for a little bit. Oh, babe, we need to go get our laundry. Oh yeah, we do. Um, are we worried about them locking it? No, but I can go grab it. Are you sure it's a lot? Yeah. You know how to sign up? What? The one person. Thank you for the 30 bits, Porto. The person who takes the last, like, washer mm -hmm. was our neighbor. Well. And then when she was taking it over to the dryer, it was the same time I was. Mm -hmm. And she was separating her blacks and whites. And I took up the other three. Why? You couldn't fit it into two? Yeah. So I was like. Well, there goes like 20 bucks. That I just got of quarters. It was, a, it was less than ten. Mhm. Mm I mean, you can see a full roll in the drawer still. So. I started with five extra over ten. Well, it might be five less than over ten. <laughs> they peeps finally less. I'm have uh, you in headphones. If you need more stories, yell. Okay. <laughs> He's gonna go grab our laundry, our, our mass amount of laundry that took up three three laundry machines and dryers. How could those possibly be uncomfortable? They're not cute or uncomfortable. Well, yeah, I mean they're not like heels. Like they're a thousand times um, more comfortable than heels. You... No, I'm not offline. I don't know why I did that. I'm glad you like them. I feel like they suit me more. They look more. They look less cartoony. Uh, so what are we on money? 112? I need a lot more than that. God damn it, the door is getting like kind of blown by the wind, so it's like doing this and it's freaking the shit out of me, not gonna lie. Alright, package, where, where are you? Is it behind a, a supply shelf? Although... The thing wasn't actually by the skull, so that doesn't- that makes me kind of not trust the whole this is here sort of thing, the location thing. Maybe working channel stuff. Cool. What are you doing with it? What are you planning on doing with your channel? I haven't even- I gotta take a look at your channel. I am following you, okay. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not super happy with the new banner. Um, I really wish that the one lady that was supposed to be making my, like, drawing my lo-fi thing didn't drop off the face of the planet and stop responding. Um, also, also, um, cause that was what was gonna be the new banner. But she has gone and I just have a sketch and I was starting to draw on it and try to prove it and I just have zero drawing skill, guys. I can't. So if anyone wants to finish it. I also don't know if I'm allowed to use it, given that I never ended up paying her for it. So all I have is the rough sketch, um, and not the full thing. Never leaves banner logo. Are you making them? I just bought mine. It's a lot easier than making them. Guess he had their f his first stream after a long time. I heard Crouch did. I was bummed I couldn't make it, but I was like crazy busy today with with everything. All right, I gotta shut this door. It's like just doing this a bunch. Creeping the shit out of me. No. Shut. Uh-uh. We aren't here for creepy ghost apartment shit. Yes, he did. Crouch, if you're here, um, and alive and whatnot, are do you play things other than Warzone? I know we're in totally different games, but I'm sure that you this isn't really a game that you would be particularly interested in yet. You're watching me play it, so I mean I drew up I'm up but pay someone to actually make it. I get that. I that's what I did with the lo-fi thing. No money was exchanged. I'd say if somehow if somehow went to court, she'd have the rights. Well of course. If it went to court, I I wouldn't if she saw my channel and saw it, I'd be like, yeah, sure, I'll take it down. But also now that you're here and like responding and stuff, like can you i I'll pay you what like the originally quoted price was or even whatever you want, like uh, to a certain extent. If you just, like, finish it. Like, I wouldn't even go to court with it. I would just be like, yeah, you can have it. Like, you drew it. I understand you have the rights. But I wanted to use it because you never gave me a final product. 
Guys, I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm only missing one more feather. So I'm close to finishing that one. Um, I'm at 132. Let's, let's fish a little bit more so I can get... I could probably also sell those shells. How much did you pay if I can if I can ask? I oh for the overlays and stuff? Or the or the um the lo-fi thing that I commissioned. That we we agreed on around I think 75, but that's because it's like a full color, like like beautiful, gorgeous drawing, which I feel like 75 is a very fair price. Um for the for the overlays, they were pre-made on um on a Etsy, and I only paid like six bucks for it. No, if money was exchanged, I say some. Um, uh, I met her taking it to court because you're using Arabic in a money making activity. Uh, I don't think she'd do that. I really don't think she would. She seemed pretty chill and nice. Um, and I think just like life, I I have like this sad thought in the back of my mind that she like died or something, and I'm over here holding it against her that she's not responding to me about the commission. And my person quoted me two hundred for my stuff. Well, what are they? What? Well, what, how much are they making? Like like not money wise, but like how much content are they making? Are they making like your whole theme for your channel? And then how like complicated is it gonna be? Um, that's why I don't. It's you're kind of, you're not going to have unique stuff um but I just love Etsy. Like I got my my emotes, not the ones that I made. Like the snake one and the Sadie one that you guys never see anymore. My my friend drew those for me. Um here. These ones my friend drew for me. I made these ones because they're just actual pictures of my animals and then these ones I bought from a uh, like pack off of uh, off of um, Etsy and she basically I was showing yonder she basically just makes the same the same emotes but changes up like the hairstyle color and the eye color um, so like different people can use it and they're usually like 10 to 15 dollars which I feel like is a very fair price for the amount of emotes I'm getting so about 250 for my overlays and branding. You're kidding, right? Like you like Porto. Bro, let me look at your channel. I need to see if this is worth the money that you spent. Like your logo is really cute. I really like your logo that you have on your your thing um and stuff, but $250, bro? That's a little much. I'm sorry. Got yeah, branding too. Pretty much all the stuff I'm getting reworked. Everything. I mean, I feel like they don't look good. Guys. You... I know I'm cheap. So I know I'm like willing to like spend the time to uh, spend three to four hours on Etsy looking for stuff. That yeah, branding look and that stuff. Bro, you spent. I'm sorry. You spent too much money. I understand that people should value their time. And, and should have a monetary value on their time. Like I under, I feel like $75 was honestly cheaper than what it should have been. Um, but like, come on dude, $250 for what is basically a background and then a small sketched up logo. I'm sorry, girl. That's, 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 you got a little gypped there. I didn't want to pay 200 but like she was the cheapest. Don't commission. Just get, just be boring. I almost, I actually currently on my page, I have two theme sets that I bought combined. So for my overlays, I have one theme and then my panels, I have another theme. And then in my, I, I just like threw together my, um, my banner, I made it, which is nothing special, but and it looks very cheesy, but it's it's a good representation of my channel. Um, and I wouldn't mind to have like a good banner, but I wanted that lo-fi thing to be my banner, but that never happened. Um, I don't know, man. For art prices in the US, maybe a whole different reality. Conversions don't always work that way. A game costs 50 bucks in the US, costs 80 bucks in Australia, and five bucks in Russia. Five bucks in Russia? Jipped, rolls his eyes with the wokeness? What do you mean? 
Gypped is like the real word, the proper word for it. I'm sorry, Porto. That sucks, dude. I would recommend just like looking at Etsy. Like maybe you'll even find stuff that you like more. Just you're you're not gonna get the uniqueness that you would get with uh with um commissioning someone. That's why I kind of want to commission someone to make a profile picture for me because. I made this one on the that one website, that one Japanese website, where you can like people do people make care avatar makers, and that's where I made it. Um. Um. No. What do you mean? See, like it's super expensive for that kind of stuff. I'll say now as I'm getting cheap emotes. Okay. Have a good night, Savan. Gypped is absolutely a slur, a, a, a slur of sweet honey buns. I've heard, I have heard gypped since I was like a very young kid. Like my parents used it. So I don't know what you're talking about. Whoa, these are worth a ton of money. How power is in social, wow. We're going to sell those. That sounds like a lot of money. I should have done that in the first place. All right, so let's, oh, no. We can buy you. Sounds great. Take my money. Purchased. Sweet. All right, ma'am. I got your thing. Got shorted or robbed or taken. My own jib is like saying Jew in this context. Oh, Jesus Christ. I didn't know. I'm sorry. I won't use that anymore. I'm sorry. I didn't know that it was related to that. I wouldn't have said that. I'm sorry. Because it was only for me. Just don't. It's just so I don't feel scanned. I'm sure you've heard it. I'm confident you've heard it, but I'll let you look up. I'm sorry. I won't say it anymore. I didn't know it was like a slur. Bro, I've been saying that like I've said that so many times. I just thought it was like a word for getting like like you said shorted. Yes, this is the bird charm I was talking about. Seems like a simple trick, it doesn't, doesn't it? But when it's placed on the ground, it transforms itself into a ghost bird. Ooh, I want to see it. Wait, I wanted to get the green one then. If it transforms into a ghost bird, are you kidding me? The poor bird is hungry. I'll order some food it will like, but the food won't arrive until tomorrow. In the meantime, let's find a spot to live. Why don't you place uh, this animal on the ground near your campfire? All right. Oh, seven hours and eight minutes. Christ. Can I move, please? Thank you. No worries, I find it horribly offensive to hold people accountable for ignorance. It's all good. Okay. I'm sorry. Here's a log for you. Yum. Do you need two? Four or more. Since at least five logs out there, maybe close, maybe far. Dude, that's a lot. Um, what do I do next? Let's. How do I place? How do I place that? Where do I? Place, I don't know. Let's place it here, I guess. I can always move him. Oh, he's so cute! Animal minder, beginner. You want a donut or is that a bagel? Pet. Hi. Is that all good? Yeah. Thank you. Some is still wet, though. Oh. Would you like to name him? Oh, my good. What name? What name do we want to name him? Oh, my good. You're rude. Bibgles is cute. What else do we got? More names. Marley, Hera. Hera! I like Hera a lot. May? I think we're gonna go with Hera. I like Hera. It's a very common word, sadly. I didn't know. I'm sorry. That could take back the buy I would. Guys, I know. I'm sorry. I shouldn't. I. <laughs> that really sucks, dude. That really, that really, really sucks. I recommend looking on Etsy for stuff. Um, there's some, there's some cute stuff on Etsy. And that way also you can change up your theme for a much more, much more reasonable price. But yeah, I'm a little worried that the artist for the profile picture maker I did is going to be like, hey, you're using it for your Twitch channel. Like, this isn't allowed. Even though I don't remember seeing anywhere that it wasn't allowed. But I just, like, should assume because I didn't pay for it. And then they're going to be, like, suing me. And that would be bad. So they said near a shelf thing. And I feel like that would be around here. Do you guys see a package anywhere? 
Behind a supply shelf. This looks like a supply shelf, bro, if I've ever seen one. Maybe it's over here somewhere? Is it just gonna be sitting there? Like, I feel like if it's just gonna be sitting there, I look real dumb if I can't find it. And I have to ask for help. I also, apparently that you can get quests for areas that you haven't unlocked yet, which is kind of dumb in my opinion. Because you could just be searching forever and never find it. Ooh, what we got? I entered and not like a service. I can't set, stand up and be like, no. Yeah. Okay, I just need one more branch. Yeah, I can, I can see that. But you can just, like, ask for the price, and then if they say no, one, you could just never respond. Like, that's an option. Maybe not for Porto, because, you know, she's her friend and whatnot. But, like, if it's just some random person on Fiverr, you can just not respond. Also, if you're going to commission someone, don't go on Fiverr. In my experience, Fiverr is way more expensive. Again, go on Etsy and talk to people who don't even have commissions. Like, if you see an artist you like, more likely than not, just because they don't have a listed commission object like a commission store thing um you can message them and that's actually how i found the person to do my lo-fi thing i just messaged them and i'm like hey i really like your art and would you be willing to do a commission and for how much and then she's like yeah totally for this much and then she never responded take my potatoes that's quite a lot of materials you gathered. And I bet you're wondering, what sort of tool is he going to make for me now? Yeah, what are you going to make with potatoes? Sorry, no tool this time. Did you know folks used to come here uh, from all over just to learn how to build and fix things for themselves? Maybe if I pass that skill on to you, I can pass on myself. My crafting bench is open to you anytime. Just stop by and let me know when you want to craft something. Here, have some crafting recipes to get you started. Just select one and learn a uh, recipe. Then you can bring the ingredients to me and get crafting. I believe you already have enough wood to build yourself something interesting. Yes. Let me show you my workshop. Ooh, I can build a chair. There's a table. Oh, log cabin planter, fence post. Oh my goodness, so cute. Um, well, I guess let's build a chair. Sounds great. Here are my materials. Let's build a chair, baby. Look at him with his little wrenches. Got my person from Twitter. Oh, okay. From a purely pragmatic perspective, it would on be absurdly stupid to file a suit. A simply written request or even cease and desist would be more than enough. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And of course I'd respect it. I would just do an actual picture of myself as a profile picture, which I've been tempted to do already. Do we think... Also, yeah, what do we think? Should I keep... I want to do a poll to my... To my, what, 10 loyal people here. Let's poll. Should I keep my current profile picture? Or should I do an actual picture of myself? Thank you, Yonder, for hosting my stream. Um, ZD's profile pic. Um, let's do current uh, uh, cartoon avatar. And then new actually i'll just do uh rl picture and if i would use the picture if you guys are following me on instagram i would use that picture um what do we think from the, from the same art as the emotes no no it is not it is not from the same person as emotes got my person twitter then i feel bad and feel like i'm waiting there wasting their time no that's how business works like, you wouldn't go into someone's store and ask them a question, a legit question. Like, I do that. You go into a store, ask about something, and then they tell you and it's out of your price, and you just be like, okay, I'm okay then. It's a waste of their time when you spend a really long time with them. Like, I've had people come in and, like, want, like, back at Laser Quest, when they want to book a party, I'd spend 45 minutes on the phone with them, and then they'd be like, actually, never mind. That's a waste of time. If you're taking, like, 10 minutes to ask a question about price and it's fine at least you keep it how it is where i feel like i have to buy something at the store <laughs> you're one of those people that if you walk in and walk back out without something you feel bad i do sometimes but not usually crafted yes sir Ooh, he gave me a ton of stuff 10 branches 10 hard wood 10 softwood Common medieval large potted plant. Oh my god, he gave me a bunch of recipes. Plant 
Large sculpture. Learn recipe. Cool. Let's just learn all of them. This is just like Animal Crossing. It's like DIY recipes. Don't simply don't. Yeah. That's like what the point the store is trying to do to you. It's trying to make you feel guilty. You're letting capitalism manipulate you. How does that make you feel? Not good, right? Learn new crafting. Common medieval potted plants. Is that all of them? Yes. All right, let's go put down this chair. Can we talk about how cute this music is too? Let's go put down the chair and then... I don't know. Here's a log for you. You need three more, right? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I wish I could like drag it. I wish I didn't have to place it exactly where I'm standing. Let's place it here. Place here. Ooh. Oh, he likes it. What'd he give me? What'd he give me? What'd he give me? Spirit bird essence. Using cooking spirit animal food, also uh, crafting ben beneficial decorations. Ooh. Hi, Futura. You're loving my top? Thank you. It's like, I got it from a thrift store, actually. It was like three bucks at a thrift store. Most of my, every time I say something, it's nine times out of ten, I got it from a thrift store because I go thrifting almost every week especially now that I live in Oregon where there's like four thrift stores within distance one of them being a giant Goodwill like Goodwill like the size of a Target it's huge guys 50 50 you can't give me 50 50 what the come on Motherfuckers. Haha, <laughs> sounds massive it is. Taking on the government with dark side, yeah. Don't let capitalism manipulate you. The poll back up, I'll use my alts to vote. Well, I'll put another poll up, but can more people do it? Like, can more people, like, answer it and not just all of Yonder's alts? What should ZD's profile pick B. Uh, RL. Here, I'll do the same. Uh, current uh, cartoon avatar or our real life pick C Instagram. Excuse me? Insta. I guess we'll just do Insta because it doesn't want to let me fit Instagram. See Insta. Go. Come on, more people vote. More people vote. Vote! There's ten of you! Please! Alright, so I still need one more feather. Um, do they want anything also? Oh, I should try to... Oh, he does want stuff. I should try to make stuff with all the new materials he gave me. I was just thinking, have you ever seen the sky like that? It's literally glowing. In school, they told us sunlight is just radiation. And now I get worried every time I see an extra pretty sunset. Ooh, okay, what do we craft? So I got, what's this? Oh my god, that's so cute. How do I get a charred fish bone? Is it literally just one fence? That's annoying. I have to build a bunch of those. I could make a chi a. a Dining table for my for my one chair. What's the difference between these two? Oh, cute! Adorable, adorable, adorable. There we go. Are more people voting? Yonder! Is that all of your alts? Is everyone saying real life photo? Is that is that just all your alts? Do you just want me to build stuff? Nah. Okay, well, I don't just want to build stuff. I want to see what the game looks like in daytime, but I don't want to hold, to change my computer's time, like, clock. Like, that seems like a lot more work than, than just, like, my switch clock. Go in the alts right now if you'd like. You change your vote? Dude, <laughs> you don't have to change your vote. Damn. Really? Everyone, everyone wants a real life pick. All right. Well, that works. I guess I'm assuming it's not going to change much past that, so. 
We got more materials. So where's the last feather? That is the question. I also would like to find this package, but I'm kind of convinced that it's just not in this area. Like I don't have it on the area unlocked that it's in. Because to me, supply shelves are... Uh, sorry, that looked like a, a thing. Are um, where that guy was. Where the crafting dude is. They watch, watch this. CD, Queen of Doubt and Yonder Sincerity. Currently 5-0. Alright, I believe you. Hey, you're giving me views. Fine by me. Give me the views. <laughs> I'm gonna sell these, these shells because I don't think I'll need them for anything. Famous lost words. Oh, looky. Goddamn. Why do you have so many alts? Let's sell uh, these guys. 300 coins! Yes, please. That one IP doesn't really count. All right. Real life insta pick. All right. Here it is. We'll change it right now. I will change it right now. Sounds good to me. I mean, oh goodness. Guys, I lost a follower. Why? I was at 709. Now I'm at 708. Why? I'll go for a stupid joke. All right. I gotta find the photo now is the issue. Um, images, Instagram. That follower doesn't deserve you. <laughs> All right. New profile picture done. Wait, there's me on there. There's my personal there's a business really in like seven jug profiles. Dude, why? All right, let's see the new profile pic. How's that? How, what do we think? Is it okay? I honestly am a little less stressed now about getting so your profile photo <laughs> can handle the anarchy for like an hour. <laughs> what anarchy? What are you talking about? What anarchy? Okay, they said also buy a tarp. Look for look for um, a feather. Well, this also looks like a tarp, and I I see no feather now. It could be that I already grabbed it, but I see no feather. Cause dumb jokes are awesome. Hits refresh. Yeah. Oh, duh! It's right here. How did I miss that? Here you go, sir. Here's your feathers. Squawk! That's the finest set of feathers. Why bother helping me, little castaway, when you have such troubles of your own? You give a quest, I do it. You reward me. That's the way this works. Oh, a pragmatist with a touch of sass. I thought that said a touch of ass for a second. Yeah, I see, ZD. You'll do well on these shores, sailor. With the with these bits of fluff pad in my coat, the wind's bite does lose its teeth. You bundled so, a, a rule of the afterlife comes to me, clear as white rum. Even in death, you cannot refeather your wings. Hi, Tessarel, of course I remember you. Yes, of course I remember you. I don't know if that was the second or the third creeper that blew it up, but I do remember that. It wasn't the first, though. I got lots of random crap in my inventory. A touch of ass. I see someone has been sampling my cooking again. Nasty. Nasty, nasty. What time? It happened four times though. It happened three, I think. Gulp. Only two more logs before I'm full. I said someone has a log that easy to give you if you can help them. Yes, I know. It's for this package. But I don't know where it is. And I feel lame using the help me find it thing. Oh, I was just thinking. I admire your work ethic, Scout. Scurrying about being helpful. Just remember to take a break every once in a while. Have a cup. Look out over the water. Have a cup? Of what? Caused one. You were the first one? Oh, no. Just one in general. Hey, now. Don't yuck your yum. That's gross. You're gross. Is it a hundred again? Okay. We'll do one last search around the town. And if we can't find it, we'll use the, the lame old... Where is it thing? One last search. Is this a rock? No. I think this is a saving symbol. Let's forget our lovely 
course he was left to die. He was not left to die. I let him free. When we stream uh, Minecraft, just wondering. Minecraft is on Mondays. And then also, so Wednesdays and Fridays are just kind of like whatever I feel like playing. So I got this little game a couple days ago and I'm like, oh, let's play Wednesday. Um, so it could also either be a Wednesday or a Friday stream or just, or definitely Mondays. He was let free to die. He was not. He was not. I took... I took a picture of the coordinates and we'll go back there next stream that we stream Minecraft. Fine. We'll go back and see him and visit him. And I, maybe I'll even take him back. Okay. Bye, Tezzeril. Have a good night. Thanks for stopping by for like two seconds. <laughs> I'm not seeing it, guys. I'm not seeing this package. You said it was behind a... a a supply shelf or was that just like a joke because they're a they're a postman postman post person post bear he's a post bear that's his, that's what he is survival the fittest he will be fine i promise we'll go back and he'll be alive and i'm gonna just leave him there just to spite you guys that's what's gonna happen where is this box dude You'd think for something just being on the ground, it would be easier to find. But it certainly is not. Ooh, wait, what? I want to get to that rope. I want the rope. Just to spite you guys, finally. I do a lot of shit to spite you guys. I do a lot of shit to spite a lot of people. It's not just you. Don't feel that special. Not us. Watch you go back there and there's just a bottle of glue. <laughs> That's so fucked! That's so fucked. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, I think we might ask what's her face where it is. Give you his best days and that's how you pay him down. Yeah, by letting him free. It's like, he's retiring. I put him through hell and back and I let him retire off to the great fields. Uh, where is it? Sounds great, here you go. This way I see. I swear to God if it's actually by the supply shelf. What the fuck? How do I miss these things, huh? How do I keep wasting money and missing these things? I love you for it. My dog food. And dog food. Why? Why? You guys are trying to make me feel bad and it's not working. Did you feel it? The rush of finding a package? The thrill of checking for a well-formatted formatted address? Let me be straight with you. I love this job. But I could use a postal helper to get me uh, with the USDs. The USDs? What's a USD? Sorry, that's postal slang. Unidentified supernatural deliverables, aka USDs, will be our primary assignment. Most of them are pretty tame. They might rattle or whisper, but that's it. And if you come across a troublesome package, one that's streaming in Aramaic, Ar Aramaic, or spewing demon fire, well, you just send that puppy my way. He was not domesticated. I got him from the wild. I got him from the wild. That doesn't even make sense. Because one way or another, that thing's bound to, addressed, to be addressed to me. I was trying to make you feel bad isn't working for one reason. You don't have a soul and therefore you're comfortable with your crimes. Aramaic. Okay, I said it right. I said it right. Did he take her horse to live out on a farm in the countryside? Ugh, guys. Ooh, and it seems I've already received a letter addressed to you as well. Wait, I have a mailbox here? Yes, here it is. I got two. Hi, it's me, Postal Bear. I sent you this letter via myself. Test, 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 test mail from Postal Bear so you can see how it works. I also include a little thank you gift for your help. Ten parsnips. Yes, please. Hope you're settling uh, into your solo camping adventure. Uh, don't be disheartened if you can't find a needy ghost immediately. I intentionally picked a safe island that's not too haunted. When you find a, a ghost, uh, when you finally find a ghost, try to help it and make peace with itself. And when you do finally graduate to second degree... And when you do, it'll finally graduate to secondary. This was Scoutmaster Blake. P.S. I'll write you every day, uh, unless I get busy. <laughs> All right. I'll keep these ones because of the beginning ones. 
Ah, uh, cute. Hello. Hi, Kazik. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the stream. This game is very similar to Animal Crossing. Um, except for I'm helping little ghosts out. What's this package? Can I have it? No. All right. Can I help you with something? Heads up, postal helper. Looks like another past marked delivery up incoming. When you're alive, letters arrive at the post office a few days after they're sent. The ghost letters, they don't run on regular time. They're likely to show up at a non-standard address, like in leaf piles or behind rocks. So if you find any letters out there, please bring them to my office. Okay, so look for a letter in the ground. I mean, right? It's nearby a crow's nest. Okay, a crow's nest. Let's see how much sense this actually makes. I really don't want to have to use another hint. Because every time I do, I feel dumb as hell. So here's a nest. Is it, is it going to be in here? No. A potato was in there. Okay, well that's one nest. I know there's another nest on the beach. But to me, this would make, be, make more sense to be a crow's nest. Given that it's in the forest. Versus the beach. I wonder what the limit is for on the screen. I don't think there is one. I really don't. Is that why you like spamming the emotes to see all the pop-ups? I get it. Before I before it was just like if you spammed an emote it would just show it once. I thought that was no fun. Can I sell anything to you? I want to sell stuff. I will sell this shell. 525 coins! I feel like I shouldn't be selling these. So you shouldn't feel the need to use a hint. Just to feel dumb as hell. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that all hints, though? Oh, I know you're trying to you're trying to take a jab at me, but isn't that just all hints? Okay, I want to get... I kind of want to get this. I feel like I have a shit ton of money and it's worth it. Even though this one's real cute. The Nip Beanie's real cute as well. But I think I should get... Aw! Oh, with this... And not this. Dude. How freaking cute. 750 coins. Okay, we'll start with this. Because I think that's pretty cute for now. Take my money. Yes, I'll wear it now. Is it flaming to access? Cool. Alright, I already love it. I already look cute as hell. I love it. She gonna sell her horse if she had one? Do you like Animal Crossing? Of course. I have over a thousand hours in Animal Crossing. Actually, I want to see. I want to see exactly how many hours I have in Animal Crossing. Uh, how do you see this? How do you see how many hours you have, actually? I remember you, you were able to see it. Okay, maybe I won't see how many hours I have in Animal Crossing. Um, I don't know how to see it. Go up to your account in the top left. Okay. Uh, profile. Where's Animal Crossing? Okay. I'm not over a thousand. I'm at over 500. I have 510 hours in Animal Crossing. So the most hours I've ever had in the game. Next to when I 100% when I like fully completed. Like not just the Pokedex. Like got every item. Did everything I possibly could. And Pokemon X. That one I think I did actually have over a thousand hours in. Oh, there's a letter! I need to grab that. Do I have an actual new recipe or are they just doing it because all this stuff is here? Do I need to do that? So that's what I need to do. Pick it up. Oh, there's three... E. A thousand hours, 500 hours, whatever. It, the point was given. I got real bored in Animal Crossing. The only things I liked was the aquarium. I, I have not played Kingdom Hearts. I've never had a PlayStation, so I never got around to it. Um, but I would love to play Kingdom Hearts. Um, I redid my whole island. I can give another I island s tour at some point. But I yeah, I redid my whole, my whole island. Delicious! Just one final log and I'll be full. I sense someone has a log they're eager to give you. If you can help them. I know. I need to find letters. So that's the other nest I was talking about, but I see no, nothing to dig. You can get PC ports. K 
can I now? I might have to do that. I might have to play a uh, play Kingdom. I almost said Final Fantasy. Kingdom Hearts, because it at Minecraft, not Minecraft. Why am I saying this? Because uh, Disney plus RPG. That's borderline JRPG. Yes, I maxed out the Pokedex on many of those games. Spent hundreds of hours or more on that. Yeah, I did. I maxed out the Pokedex on. I did on. Just the Pokedex in Sword and Shield, the original one. I did that. I did on on um, I almost said Alola. That's the region. Sun and Moon. I the last couple games I have. Should I not have said that, Yonder? I went and played Demon Souls recently using an emulator since I never had Oh, but if it's on an emulator, emulators like freak me out. I never liked emulators, I don't know why. I used to play old Pokemon games on emulators on my PC and then I realized, oh, I literally own the actual old game that I can play. Because it just isn't the same if you don't have, like, the proper controls. Hey, you found some loose letters and a thank you card for Jeremy. Lawsuit notice for Clyde and bills of my, uh, for my wife, Anya. Is she gay? Or is it, is she a she or is, she a he, or is he a he? I don't even know. I'm gonna say they, just in case. I'm gonna say they from now on. And here's one for me. Ah, there. Uh, threat of disembowelment by a hundred skeletal claws. Standard stuff. Oh, did you see her? their little face? I'll make sure the rest of these get to the right place. And hey, check in with me once, you, uh, once in a while in case I've got anything for you. We got a new badge. What else? Wait, wait hold up. Potted poppy? Ooh. What is this? Objects are important to some, but they may not be ready to receive it yet. Hold on for a while longer. Oh. Well, okay. Okay. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, I was just thinking. Hey there, Letter Legend. Have you checked your mailbox today? You never know what be in there. I don't think I'll get anything new. Yeah, I think I've already got everything. We got our last log. Yeah, I've replayed through Pokemon Sapphire seven times. The pandemic. Why Sapphire? We're playing it on that than, than using the keyboard. Yeah, I wonder, I've never tried, um, oh, nope. I've never tried uh, playing with a controller on, cause I didn't, I used to like, you know how I feel about controllers. We've gone over how many times how I feel about controllers. Um, but I'd never had a controller that I could use on my PC before. My favorites in the first Pokemon game, Pokemon game I ever played. That's how I feel about silver. But I just play soul silver cause it's like, you have Pokemon that follow you around and stuff. Here's a log for you. Yes, let's expand, baby. Let's expand. Getting hungrier for more spirit wood every time you feed me. And that spirit wood is growing harder to find. How can that be when there are still so many needy shadows hiding in Cozy Grove? I'll decide um, a balanced team of mostly moms. Mo <laughs> moms. Mons. I've never used um, keep redoing runs. Oh, yeah. I don't, I hate team building. I hate, I do it for every single game, but like once I do it once, I never do it again. Cause I just, I hate team building. It's not my thing. Cause I need pictures of the teams I've used. Yeah, dude, totally. Send me pictures. Wait, I see someone standing in the forest. Or am I mistaken? Perhaps this is an oddly shaped tree. I just got these like stress balls from work and they're so nice. They're like the, the dough balls, like they have, oh. They have dough in them, like Play-Doh or something. Um, and they, we sell big ones, like bigger ones that are like this big for like $3. And there was a pack of three for $3. And they're so tiny and cute and they have such pretty colors. The only thing is they're getting sticky from me using them so much. But they feel so cool. And I actually kind of like the sticky, not gonna lie. Yes, Tesserol, I still remember you. Don't worry. Tail building for these runs has motivated me to even play replay these games. I know. I It would be completing the Pokedex over and over again. I love completing Pokedexes. Especially when you have both games and you can get all like the game specific Pokemon. The idea of using a team specific mom can me do whatever it takes me to 30 to 40 25 to 30 hours to finish. It's the it's like the um what are the stats that you get from breeding and then defeating certain Pokemon? You know what I'm talking about, right? Where you, like, get a certain defense of version of the IP, EVs, I IVs and EVs. It's the EV and IV breeding and grinding that I hate doing. Because I cause creeper to blow up your farm. Yes. Yes. I do remember you. Let's place this cute little potted plants. I'll put it over here. Can I, like, 
get a real tent yet? Maybe? I also like how they forced me to put my house here. Because then I don't have to spend forever to figure out where I want to build my house. Cute. It's an EV training I completely know. I've used. I got... Who's in Pokemon X, like I said, I got into Ivy breeding. I really did. I, I even, I still have a, a Japanese ditto at, that um, has perfect IVs sitting. Because I remember I met, I talked to someone on, on, a, on a Discord server, I think. Or it might have been on Facebook. I don't know. On, on Instagram. But I talked to someone in, who had, um, was in Japan, had a, or not in Japan, but had a Japanese game. And we're like, hey, we're going to breed each other dittos and trade them. And we did. So I still have a perfect ditto um, with... I know it's simple, it just takes forever, and then you fuck it up, and then you get real upset. Ba, 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 ba. What do you want from me? Can I help you with something? You're well on your way to being completely orient orienteered, Scout. I hear you've been helping out other ghosts in the island. That's nice thing for you to do. That's a nice thing for a spirit scout to do. Hey, since you're out there searching for missing things, have you seen my tea mug? Have you? No, but I can find it for you, maybe. I've heard it's close by a dead tree. Okay. Ooh, that's a different type of coin. Oh, no. It's just a big, better coin. Never got upset because, like, mine isn't for competitive. Yeah, mine usually wasn't either. It was just to, like, battle my friends and show that I'm better than them. Um, but I would still get upset because I'd mess it up. And, like, just the fact that I know it's messed up would piss me off. I'm just trying to finish the game, migrate the mons up to my soul silver and start another with these mons I've never used before. Uh, dead tree with a bird's nest. You'll find it buried in the uh, pile. I saw one near a skull. So close I can taste it. Well, there's a skull right here. But there's, what, five she's missing? Okay, well, there's one. Here's the start. What's this? What's this? Hello? Nothing? Nothing. All right. So near a dead tree with a bird's nest. Well, this is a bee nest, so not a bird's nest. Let me see. Let me know if you guys see any other pastries, by the way. Because we do need to find three of them. Ah, you're so sweet. I love you guys, too. Love you guys very much. Okay, well, I'm assuming this one isn't it. The only other nest I know about is on the beach. So we can go check that out. Oh! Oh! Yes, thank you, Pordo. I didn't even see he said that. I'm sorry. Good on the link. It said it was expired or something. Oh, no! What? It doesn't seem expired. I just clicked on it and it didn't seem expired. I can get a new link. Here, let me get you a new link. Light people. Copy. Okay, I didn't know it was expired. I'm gonna have to go through and you want a portal chat. Wait, what link? The link in my like, on my channel is expired. Okay, I need to go check that out and fix that. I won't do it right now, but I I need to do that. The one in the description said didn't work. Jesus, God damn it. Okay, I'll fix it. Oh, look at the two other ones are right there. Ah, you look like a log, Fran Francesca Duclaw. Who dares? Who dares disturb the forest? Just a spirit scout. I mean, a spirit scout? Really? Look at this face. Look at that face. So, someone finally comes to clean up our mess. I thought you were just an imp. Back to torment me as usual. It's been a while since we've had uh, a living, breathing creature in these woods. For decades, um, it's just been me and my fellow trees. Can they talk like you? So, you're a tree also? Yep, I'm the only tree in this clearing uh, with manners, apparently. Emerson Carson. Chow, chow. Uh, Thoro? Is it Thoreau? Thoreau? Oh, Thoreau. Like the author. Um, say hello to our guest. Not the author. The um, Well, I guess I think he is actually an author too. But the... What's the word? Fuck, guys. Yonder's going to come in and correct me. You know what I mean. Henry David Thoreau. They must be feeling shy. Of course, I'm a little different from your typical tree. I'm sure you've noticed. It's my embarrassing lack of leaves. I see two leaves right there. What are we talking about? Oh, I was wondering what Henry David Thoreau is. Um, I forgot the word. What, what the word was. Yeah? Did you see the Discord voice I worked 
I have not fixed it yet, but I but the one in the the um that she sent in chat worked. Okay. He you can, you can make one that uh never expires. I know. That's what the one in the the code is. American naturalist. See, that's what I knew him for. It was a naturalist, a poet, and a ph philosopher. That's the word. Philosopher was the word I was looking for. A writer, an author. He was an author. But I know him because as a naturalist. That's why. Because of my major and whatnot. Environmentalist, baby. Would you mind finding my leaves for me? Sure. I guess. Enjoyed your stupid four to six minutes. <laughs> that's why you didn't have to stay. I might be drunk. Enlightened mofos. Yeah. Yes. All right, let's get this. And then there were the two, uh... Ooh, what was that? Turnips? Radish. Look at the two the little two pastries down here, right next to each other, making my life easy. He was a hack, Emerson for life. <laughs> All right, what you want from me? What you want from me? Can I help you with something? I think you picks up all the teams I've used in my run so far. Okay, I'll check in a second. Hello, buddy. Hello again, maker buddy. I've been thinking about you. Stuck here on Cozy Grove. You and I. We're sort of in the same pickle barrel, aren't we? Um, I'm allergic to pickles. Oh, sorry. How insensitive of me. Stick to woodworking and leave uh, clever sayings to the professionals. That's what my mom always said. Oh, I feel bad now. All I mean is neither one of us quite knows what we're doing here, do we? But I can help you dig a little deeper into this mystery. With five branches and one piece of softwood, I think I can do just that. Uh, well, I have that. Yes, that's great. I was worried I'd ask too much of you. Here you go, your very first pickaxe. It's a little flimsy, but it should dig right into the rock of the island. And while digging, if you happen to find any answers about why I'm doomed to haunt this place, well, I wouldn't mind knowing is all. Okay, cool. What did he also give me? A bone pickaxe, and then what was this? Co common log... Oh, I can make a log cabin? Yes. Okay, we found four out of the five. Damn it. Look near a sand sculpture. Oh, I know where that is. I know where that is. And I also want to look by the the tree in here for her mug. Because I think it might be somewhere around here. Yep. I'm using my favorite Pokemon each time, though. I'm assuming your favorite Pokemon are all from Sapphire, given that that's your favorite Pokemon game. Okay, I'm going to look at your teams now. Let me, let me check it out. Let me check it out. Also, I knew it was Philosopher. I just, or I knew I started with a P, but I could not think of it. Gardevoir, nice. Nice. Flygon. I can tell you like Gardevoir. Not gonna lie. Goddamn, you really like Gardevoir. Ah! Yes, I do like these teams. Of course, I'm forgetting Pokemon's name right now, but... Berloom? Um, whatever the one the fighting grass Pokemon in your left I loved I used him and I can't remember his name I'm sorry but I used him in my um I'm forgetting all the names of the games Johto Hoenn fuck fuck no Omega Ruby. Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. That's the, that's the Berloom. That's what I used it in. Geek and Eekard of War also works as a linchpin for my runs. <laughs> Disappointing Nine of War Zone, no runs. Ah, oh, I'm sorry, Crouch. P, he was a P Hake. A naturalist who literally lives on the edge of the town and bought stuff in the store like twice a week. I mean, can't you have naturalist ideas and still want to live a non-naturalist lifestyle? So I can uh, use it as a setup mon double team. Okay. Wow. You're talking a lot of complex stuff that I never got into. Alright. I do know where the sand sculpture is. So I can actually find this. I'm starting to sort of learn the map. And they're just going to keep adding more stuff. And I'm not going to be able to figure shit out. Ooh. I need to grab keep grabbing these uh, shells. Because they make me a lot of money. I can be a hypocrite for sure. <laughs> ah, that ill wind is back. I've been stuffing feathers in my coat all morning to no avail. If I can't get warm from some quarter soon, I'll have to give up my dramatic seaward post posture. Squawk! I wonder if he could help. Who? Why the merchant of mischief, trickster of terra firma, my constant tormentor, Mr. Kit. 
Ah, uh, because he's a bird and Mr. Kid's a fox. It's funny. I've encountered four shiny Pokemon so far in these runs with, like, just randomly, not, like, looking. That's pretty crazy if you just randomly. Some say he sells wares that can cure Captain of the Shivers. Perhaps these are just fishermen's tails. Ah! Uh, oh, I thought it was a sweater for me. I got excited. There's the last pastry! Well, those quests were a little bit easier. Um, go exploring. Look by a beach umbrella. Oh, there's a leaf. Dude, these leaves are going to be hard to find. They're like... I feel like they're going to blend in like crazy. Okay, at least they're all on the beach so they don't blend into the um, grass on the ground. He also said look by a boat. Or is that the one I just got? Seeing two skulls tied to stakes. Oh, that's up here then. I mean, I don't think that's going to be on the beach. But I also feel like I should keep looking on the beach. I feel a little lame using the clues, not gonna lie. Random while grinding. Well, grinding makes sense. You'd find them because you keep encountering the same Pokemon over and over again. And that's like a method to shiny hunting. Harvest Rocks Pickaxe. Yes, sir. Will do. Um, let me hold in hand. Right? And then harvest. I think my inventory is getting real full too. So we're getting kind of ready for shiny Pokemon. I think it's less than that, dude. I think it is. I think that might be like after the shiny, you get the shiny charm by getting, by finishing the Pokedex. Can I upgrade my, yes, upgrade my tent. Feeling cramped, upgrade your tent with 12 edition, 5,000 coins. Goes directly to the scout. That's a lot. No thanks. I'm good. Um... How do I get it? I want... Well, whatever. Let's dump some stuff in here for now. Um, I'll, I'm not going to need this for a long time, apparently. So I'm going to leave that. I don't think I'll be able to do anything with this for a little while. That'll do for now. Is that in the older games? She got my mom's to have Pokemon in a run. Wow. that That's truly nuts. That's even less than shiny. I just got lucky that I have, like, a Pokerest Pokemon from a long time ago that I just keep transferring up my games. Um, speaking of, I think I'm still paying for Pokemon Bank or whatever the new Pokemon thing transfer thing is now. I never do it. Like, I'm refilling it, po every Pokedex, every run. Like one, yeah, that's, that's truly, truly nuts. Uh, all right. All right, all right, all right. Pokemon Home. Yes, Pokemon Home. I'm definitely still paying for it. Although I do only think it's like five bucks a year. So nice to see my mug again. I think I lost it yesterday. Given my ghostly condition, it's hard for me to be sure. Yeah, it does seem like time is a little wonky when you're a ghost. The one on the Switch, yes. A ghost existence is a little confusing, you see. Our sense of here and now is all mixed up with our memories, our past lives. I think I transferred all my Pokemon into Sword and Shield, though. I got Shield. Objects from the past tend to appear and disappear as we think about them. I still have the original Pokemon Crystal version. That's pretty cool. I don't know if I have Crystal. I don't think I do. In the Game Boy Color. I might have Crystal. I'll have to look. I have my Game Boy. I think I have it, like, right here, actually. Mm. Maybe not. Maybe not. Uh, I think my Game Boy is in the other room. I have my, my DS here. With all my many games. Look at all look at all these games. Oh shit. Oh god. Look at all those games. And then of course I have Kirby for the regular DS here. And I have these are all my old Pokemon games. All the old Pokemon games that aren't the Game Boy ones. And of course, Pokemon Soul Silver, my favorite Pokemon game. I even had these guys. The the styluses. And I had a fancy click stylus as well. What else we got in here? And then, of course, the beautiful new Nintendo 3DS XL. I bought this with my own money when I was, like, 15. Or, or probably even younger. I was saving up for a while for this baby. Because I had the, the Nintendo 3DS before, and then I wanted... I saw my aunt with the XL, and I'm like, I, like, need the XL. Like, I need it so bad. And then when they came out with the new one, I'm like, let's just buy it. And then I ended up passing down my 3DS to Trevor. He never used it, and I still think I have it somewhere. 
I got the 2DS because it was $40 cheaper. Yeah, but it, come on. Like, come on. It's like a flip phone, bro. It's like, I, don't you miss the, like, flip phone shit? Come on, look at this. Isn't this beautiful? Why, why? I wish, I, part of me wants to start playing on my DS again and, like, carry it around. Because, God, when you could just throw this into your purse and, like, bring it to school and then after you finish an exam, just, like, don't mind me playing Pokemon. Oh, my God. I want to go back to those days. Like, the stylist. Can we go back to those days? Let's see what I have in here. Pokemon Ultra Sun, probably for me transferring my Pokemon. This makes me so nostalgic. I want to start playing on this again. I really do. I think I might. I think I might start my new Leaf Town over, because I still miss playing Animal Crossing and filling up the, up the um, museum. But I already finished my museum on uh, New Horizons. Oh, I love my DS so much. I feel the ultimate nostalgia. Or might it be a memory of the mug? Made from solid, made solid by energy from the beyond. They made mid red and blue rescue team. I'll switch on a great time playing through it again. This team was the first games I got for the DS along with Diamond. I know, I need to finish, uh... I ended up buying the, the new mystery dungeon for Pokemon on my, on my Switch. I needed to finish it. It got stuck and I stopped. My phone was across the counter. I heard the zipper of the bag. And I started laughing because I have one of those bags too. It's a great bag. Rescue Team DX. Or might be... Oh, I took that. Sip. Either way, it's a tea. It's tea is hot. hot it's, it's tea is hot and tasty. Why was it so hard for me to say? If you got stuck, I can make suggestions. I'm okay. Thank you, though. I'm probably not going to go back to it anytime soon, so, given that I have so many games I need to play on my Switch still. See any rescues I can help. <laughs> hey, maybe. I never actually use that feature. What we got? We got a sweet potato, aka yam. Actually, I think they are technically different. Here's your log, sir. Gulp. I need six more logs before I'm full. Yeah, I know. All right, so I need to go buy a sweater and I need two more leaves, which one is by two skulls tied to a stake. Well, there's a, there's multiple of those, but I guess we can check out all of them. Oh, there's one. That worked out. Found overpowered combos in that game. I never got too into it, dude. It was not, it was not my favorite type of game. I did enjoy it at a time, but it was not, it was never like my go-to. I mostly just got it on Switch because I thought the art was super cute. Alright, where's the last one? It was left near a folding chair. I don't know where a folding chair is. You gonna get the new Pokemon games? Uh, for sure, for sure the open world one. Like, I am so hyped for the open world one. I don't remember the name of it, but it's not coming out till I think late next year. Diamond and Pearl, I'm gonna get it just because it's a Pokemon game and I buy nearly every Pokemon game. However, I just... Legends Arceus, yeah. Although, I'm kind of tempted not to get Diamond and Pearl. I didn't care for the original Diamond and Pearl, and it's probably, like, one of my least favorite Pokemon games. And then, I hate the remaster of it. I'm like, are you serious? Like, why didn't they make it look like... Why didn't they make it look like, um... Did you have stories to tell us from today? I will tell you, yes. I can't go into too much detail because one is about, a, about my court case that I'm in right now. Um, and I don't like have like two viewers anymore, so I can't talk about it on stream. Um, but that's not telling you guys to leave. You better not leave. Um, but I hate how they... Why did they make them look like sword? Yeah, why didn't they make them look like short, sword and shield? Like, seriously. Like, why didn't they... We're progressing so far in, in Pokemon as an art style, and I feel like that was just, like, reverting back. And I, I don't know. When I saw it, I'm like, are you fucking serious? Like, they did... When they did that with... With Link... Um, what was it? Link Between Worlds? Is that what this one was? Whatever this one was. When they did this, I thought it was so adorable. I'm like, that is great. That is beautiful. I love it. I love it so much i loved this game but when lethal remake sounds great until you realize how it's lazy exactly it's like okay let's not be creative let's not do new things let's just make it look like chibi and cute 
but I don't know. I really didn't like it. I really, really didn't like it. Um, how much is a sweater? I want to buy something. Excuse me, where's the sweater? Hold up. Do I have to buy it from clothes? I want to buy clothes. Oh, it's not, that's not even expensive. Sounds great. Take my money. Yes, please. Oh, I didn't mean to wear it. Shit. Okay, I'm gonna have to go to my closet and, and take it off. Where is the last one? Near a folding chair. Um... Well, this looks like a folding chair. But I don't see it anywhere. Unless she was standing in front of it. See, I don't... That seems kind of dumb to put it on the grass. I hope it's not on the grass. Well, let me go grab my old dress back and then I can go bring him... Him his sweater. My clothing collection. I would like to wear this. And I would like to put this in my backpack. I did really like shield despite the issues. It was okay. I didn't like the wild area at first and then I learned to like it. Um, oh! Oh, that's the folding chair. It's not that close, not gonna lie. That's one of my favorite Pokemon games. One of the most nostalgic for us. So I'll definitely play it, but I don't know if I'll really enjoy it. Yeah, I think I'll, like, ask for it for, like, Christmas or something. Oh, I'm sorry, Crash. I'm sorry. I'm literally gonna change the title of this game, this stream, to be, like, talking about Pokemon. Okay, I literally up so I updated. So the rumors were, if the fox sells wares as fine as these, I'll permit him to haunt the dry docks for now. Yes, indeed, the chill is fading uh, already. This is a wing warmer of the finest quality. I think I'll add it to my cabinet of the mind. What's the cabinet of the mind? Why every explorer worth the, their salt has a cabinet of the mind? Though some of the less lyrical among them might call it an item collection. Squawk. Also, I don't know why I do this when I type. Um, it's an imaginary box I use to track the doodads, whelps, and gollywoots I've come across in my travels. Once you have an idea, you can easily imagine an item collection of your own. Right. Is this item collection even real? As real as you want it to be. Uh, I see it taking shape. Anything you'd like to donate? Why would I want to donate stuff? I mean, you can have, I don't know, the shell, I guess. What a rough hawking conch! Shall we add it to the collection? Sounds great. Here you go. I'll archive this right away. Is this like the museum? Book of Secrets? Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. Oh! This is a museum. This is like the museum. Okay, that's pretty cool. Alright, that's pretty damn cool. Alright. Want to hear something funny? Sure, Kazakh. And I'll talk about my stories. So... I was telling you guys about how I had, like, a massive headache earlier. Um, sorry, I know. Oh, okay. Um, put on my team for runs. Seven, eight, and then realized I hadn't put any mons that learned to fly on other teams. Oh, yeah. Yep. That won't work. Um, so this morning I was talking about how I had a massive headache. And I was like, oh, today's my day off. Like, I can sleep in and stuff. And I was laying down, sleeping in. And then my phone buzzed. Um, and I'm like, but it was like the buzz as if like I had something on my calendar or something. Aha, those leaves are the, are the leaves I was looking for. Thank you. Hmm, I can't seem to reattach them. I can't even find the branches they came from. How strange. Woodsworth, Frost, any thoughts on the matter? Typical. Most of the time these trees won't stop rustling. But as soon as I need their opinion, then silence is golden. Cute. Oh my god. Add color to it. I want to see it in color. Come on. Wait, are they not going to have it in color? Okay, I was say, I want it in color. Adorable. Back, I can't sleep. Everything doesn't give you a break, don't it? Sleep with, a, sleep with a stream on in the background. Or like a YouTube video or something. I actually can't sleep without anything on the background because of my brain. Um, let me see what he wants. Thanks for your help earlier, little spirit. Did you notice the burst of color that occurred afterwards? It was hard to miss. I suppose it was rather dramatic. Bring color to the island. Also, I just realized this is a little skull. It's a noble thing. This place isn't meant to be so gloomy and lifeless. I bring this up because my dear friend Thoreau is in need of your help. He's the walnut tree over there. Just out of reach of my color. 
He's got an umbrella snagged in his branches that is bothering him terribly. I'd ask you to shake his umbrella free, but because the rose uncolored, mortals like you can't interact with them. He can't even grow walnuts in his uncolored state. Poor thing. He looks so barren now. I need to extend the reach of my color to help him. Take this spirit lamb and place it in the color's edge domain to extend it to Thoreau. Will do. Listen to music. I'm super hot in my room and I know where to cool it down. I'm so sorry. Do what I did when it was like 100 degrees. Put a wet towel on your back. Yikes. I mean, I'd look at that video. I'd actually want to listen to it. Oh, no. I ended up putting on Inside Out last night. And then when I woke up in the middle of the night, I put on... Um, uh, the movie with the aliens? Whatever. You know what I mean. Another Disney movie. I can't remember what it's called. Um, but anyways. Cool on the back of your neck is the best copy medicine. Yes, I would do... I Well, I have a plushie that's like a cooling plushie, so I put it... I'm sorry. I don't... I don't I can't remember what his name. No, not Home. No, it's a Disney movie. It's a one of the most recent Pixar movies. No, one of the most recent Pixar movies. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm bound. Something, something like that. Uh, I keep wanting to talk about the story. Goddamn, poor Crash. Um, yeah, I woke up with a headache, and then I is this the where's the lamp thing? Where's the thing that she wants me to do? Guys, I have too many things I'm focused on right now. Place the lamp to extend the color. What lamp? What lamp are you talking about? What lamp? Is this the lamp? Is it just a general lamp? Common cottage lamp. Well, I guess we'll do the, the common log lamp. Hold in hand. Alright. Land Covenant. Homebound? Homeward? I don't know. God damn it, guys. Let me look it up. Pixar movies list. Is it Homeward? Onward! 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 That's it. I watched... Oh, I didn't watch it, but I put it on. Ladies, I didn't know you hate me. I don't hate you. I'm trying. Uh, aliens are spread. Yeah, I slept with Alien in the background. Then I got back to watching House. There's tons of clips. What do you mean? What, what's House? I'll watch, like, home renovation shows when I go to sleep, but that I even want to watch. Yes, they are aliens. They're on a different planet. House MD. Oh. Um, but, yes. Yeah, so, I slept. What am I saying? Oh, yeah. So, I slept in, and I heard my phone buzz as if I had, like, a thing on my calendar that it's trying to remind me of. And I... I was like, oh fuck, what do I have? Looked at I had a I had a financial aid orientation for my they're not L well yes they are L, but it is confirmed to be on another planet other than Earth. There are two either moons or suns. I think there's two suns. It is confirmed to be on another planet. Do you do you even know the Pixar theory? One of the kinds of shows that are like NCIS and Criminal Minds. I would not be able to sleep like that. Um you got the curse umbrellas out of Thoreau's hair. Now I can finally stop whining about it. You have our gratitude, spirit friend. And while you're here, maybe you can find a new home for my other friend. Here you go. What other friend? Oh. Is it an animal? Is it a pet? Pink lady tree? Oh, it's an apple tree. Mmm, fake news. <laughs> but yes. Okay, so anyways. I had a financial aid orientation thing that I completely forgot about. Thank God I put it in my calendar and that my phone alerted me 10 minutes before it starts. So I like rushed over to my computer, poured myself a bowl of cereal and like was there for that. And then that ended up just stressing me out more because one, it was for, so my school that I'm going to has two different campuses. Well, it was for the other campus. Luckily, most of the information applied to my campus as well. So it was useful to me. But just the amount of financial aid stuff that people they're talking about how they give out and how I get jack shit of it because uh, my parents make over, okay, my mom makes over $100,000 a year, so I don't get any FAFSA help, but my parents aren't going to help me with uh, school at all, so I don't get any of that money. Um, so I'm real stressed out by uh, by paying for school because I, I saw the tuition, my tuition pay for uh for for per year and i'm like that's ridiculous and then i also found out i can't change my residency since a log in your bag i have a second one yikes yeah since i was sleeping to that show i said i've been bitching it that's true 
Leave four more logs. Look, there are no more spirit logs out right now. That's all right. We have to help people at the pace they're willing to be helped. Let's relax, ease into the trip, maybe do some fishing or collect some shells. When you come back tomorrow, I bet the ghosts will be ready to help some more. See? Damn it. This game would be so good on Switch. This game would be so freaking good on Switch. Sits on calls name, stuffing face with cheers. She just calls name, panicking, looking at milk, dripping, muffling, yelling here. <laughs> no, okay, there was no attendance. I mean, they took attendance, but, like, I wasn't required. It wasn't mandatory for me to be there. Um, but I, so I was there, and I found out how much I have to pay, and I'm like, I can't afford this. So I'm stressing out about that, frantically trying to look for student loans um, that I can get, um, that I have to do with, with, uh, going like I have to go to a bank to get loans because yes FAFSA gave me a loan yes my school is giving me a loan but it is nowhere near enough um what minus lights why well whatever it is nowhere near enough to pay for my school and like my scholarships like yes I'm getting a fair amount of scholarships but like not nearly enough to pay for my school so I'm stressed about paying for school now and it's starting also stressed about hi it's such a late orientation day um because I'm a transfer student so they're like hey she is not she has no credits with us but she's a junior so let's give her the latest the latest registration date for her classes um let's that which is like almost three months after everyone else can register so that's stressful but I was told not to worry because like it's not like California schools where it's um, where it's like, if you register late, you're fucked sort of thing. I'll archive this right away. Yes, please. We got more shells. Oh, okay. I'm just going to donate a bunch of shit. Um, but yeah. And then after that, um, I got a call from my friend. I'm just going to say friend because that's the most broad thing I can say without, you know, revealing anything. Um who's a witness in my court case that I'm doing. And I can't say any more than that, guys. I'm sorry. Get president. Ooh, this gives me money? Bro, yes. Um, I'm so I'm just gonna say that. Uh, and she was telling me about all the bullshit that's going on on her side of the case. And I'm like, great, wonderful. Looking forward to it, awesome. And then so because of that, I had to call my attorney and tell her everything that's going on and then uh, yeah so i'm just i'm just it's just a constant stress day and then quadruple murder isn't it have you ever played dark souls i have not and i would never want to also hi crystal welcome to the stream we're playing a game that's very similar to animal crossing that i kind of wish i got on switch instead of pc but that's all right i'll just be playing this instead of stardew every day do my daily stuff. What else can we donate? Pink paw. Sounds great. Here you go. Oh, I knew it. Yeah, that's not my type of game, dude. It really ain't. Ten quartz gemstones. Ooh. Cool. I want to donate some sweet potatoes. Sound great. Here you go. Saifia considers Dark Souls 2 and 3 are both on sale for Steam. 75% off. Yeah, a lot of stuff is on sale for 75% off that I wouldn't play. I would not enjoy Dark Souls. I'm not. I would hate it. I've seen people play it and I just can't. Talking about my comment. Oh. Yes. Yep. Get present. What'd I get? 500 old coins. Dude, guys. We're rich. Let's donate a radish. And let's fish it. Let's go fishing too, and then we can donate a bunch of fish as well. Cool, cool. I think we're out of stuff to donate, but oh, I guess not. Given that it's still saying I can. Small iron ore sounds great. Here you go. Dark Souls is definitely on the list of if it's not for you, it's definitely not for you. Yeah, yeah. Did you ever try it as a co-op and I'd help you out? Well, that sounds good. I, if I ever try it in a million years. Totally. Oh my god, I have to collect so many, so many things. You seen? Ah, oh, look at all my little badges. Log burner intermediate. Reach level five. What we got? Complete introductory tutorial. Cool. And then complete story. Conversation beginning. Complete story quests. 
question do you main do you or your, your main squeeze know anything about VR? Uh I don't know if you'll be able to see it from here. Oh my my monitor is blocking it. Yeah, it's blocking it. Uh you can't see it. You can't see it, fuck. Well there is a there's a there's a Oculus Quest 2 on the wall over there. I tried. And you can play Subnautica in VR. Yes, it always prompts me if I want to play it. And I'm like, fuck that. Fuck that nonsense. But yes, there I have a I have a, a an Oculus Quest 2 hanging on the wall over there. Yeah, it's good. I mean, all I like pretty much play. I mean, I played Job Simulator cuz that's what I mostly wanted to play. I might buy the Rick and Morty game while it's still on sale. Um, but I mostly play Beat Saber. Beat Saber is the like next level fun. Designed from the beginning for VR. Yeah. I well Subnautica was? I'm looking at VR, I don't know which is the best one. Oculus Quest 2. Like it is the best one, I'm sorry. The software is kinda garbage because it's just they're going Oh, this is such cute art. Um thinking of the Valve one. I just think the Oculus Quest is the most budget-friendly with the most, like, to do on it. I don't know. I don't know too much about anything other than the Oculus and the Steam VR. Um, but I do, I do feel like the Oculus Quest is good because it was reasonably priced. Um, I got the one with, like, barely any storage on it because I mostly buy games on the computer and just plug it in because you can play it without the computer. So I really, I actually just have Beat Saber on as the one I can, like, that's just installed on the headset instead of Steam. Um, that way I can play it in the living room while, you know, Trevor plays in here, uh, plus on his computer and whatnot. But I did a lot of, most of my games are on my PC, that way I don't have to use the storage. Instead of getting a thing so I can play Fallout 4 in VR, but I don't know. It's expensive, and I f honestly feel like with the, how expensive it is, I do not play it enough. Subnautica, not Subnautica, uh, Beat Saber is great. Beat Saber is phenomenal, but... I definitely don't play it enough to justify it. Next level. She's used to my standard glares. Oh, are you saying how I called something next level? Like, it's great. Like, it's better than other things. Have you played any real games on VR? Well, what do you mean? What real games? Trevor plays uh, that one shooter game, Pavlov, on VR. Um, and then I've played Beat Saber, Job Simulator. I've, d I've watched a bunch of their, like, things. I used to super judgy glare. <laughs> I'm on my next level glaring face. Why? What's wrong with me saying that? Why are you guys look to make fun of the way I talk? Huh? I'm used to yonder doing it, but you guys too? Come on. Come on. It's rude. Okay, let's fish to get stuff to donate. And donate these shells too. Does Truck Simulator have VR? I have no idea, dude. Good, she's not even reading chat, is she? I said she was putting on my next level glaring face because you don't have an OR2 and don't place a Nautica on it. Oh, okay. Well, I'm... Yana, you know how hard it is to keep up with chat and play the game? I'm over here trying to do like a thousand things at once right now. I'm sorry. I thought you guys were making fun of me for saying next level. I I don't think I'd be able to do Subnautica now. I'd be too stressed out. But maybe I guess maybe that's probably why the the Subnautica keyboard controls are such garbage because it's made for VR. I'd hope the VR controls are better then. Cuz I will say the worst Subnautica phenomenal game. Absolutely phenomenal. H has god awful controls and I wish someone told me it before I bought it. Just so I can be mentally prepared for it. Because it's terrible. Come on. Come on. What the? There we go. Jeez. I don't have that problem. Well, because your chat isn't moving as fast as mine is, usually. Apparently enough, I found the controls fantastic after I changed, like, three to four of the controls that I have for fall. And I, see, I don't want to have to change the controls. It's not even, the, 
The controls are fine. It's the, like, why can't I press escape to get out of things? Like, why do I have to press tab again? Why do I have to press E again? Like, why can't I just automatically blanket statement press escape? It's revolutionary, brand new, gonna change the world. Wait till people discover it. Whoa, revolutionary. Oh, do I have enough? Or is it 5,000 to upgrade my cabin? I was gonna say, do I have enough to upgrade my cabin? Maybe we'll grind to get to there and sell shells and fish and whatnot after I donate all the ones I haven't already. This is straight up, straight up Animal Crossing. But I kind of love it. Animal Crossing in Don't Starve style. I wish this area wasn't all gray. Like, I wish I could, I could do the quest for this area. Oh, too far. Is he gonna turn around? Yes. Pretty sure tons of games use escape for the menu and I don't. Yes. Um, so I think it was Terraria that used escape for the menu and I ended up changing it to E, like Minecraft, because I just, I couldn't stand how, like, t to me, escape is how you get out of things, not how you go into things. It's literally called escape. Um, welcome back, Sin. How was work? How'd it go? Fixing stuff, installing stuff at Chick Fil A. But yeah, to me, it doesn't make sense when escape is literally called escape to get to back out of things, and then you use it as a menu button. But I'm glad I'm not alone in that. That was distracting. At some points, how was I distracting? What did I do? What did I do? She's annoying like that. Wow. I mean, you can turn off. My stream. Port, are you still playing Fortnite? How's Fortnite going? How's not Fortnite doing yet? Her game I've played on my PC. Tab is usually inventory type menus. Mm. I don't really know what it usually is. I'm used to tab with Subnautica, but I think just because I, like, my entrance to gaming, well, to PC gaming was Minecraft, I'm just so used to E. The E is, like, instinctual for me. Um trying to think of what it is i think it might even be tab for don't starve as well but i can't remember what it is for don't starve i'm trying to think across all the survival games i play what everything is give me the shells Ooh, new ones Con conchologist i feel like that's not actually a real thing if that is that what the study of shells are it's up for an hour ago i'm in minecraft now Ooh, what you doing in minecraft when the uh, the idios the idiocy um that is wasd is literally anything that isn't on the extreme left edge of the keyboard something truly brave what anything that isn't w a if anything uses wasd like or doesn't use wasd for walk around it's either it's either gotta be arrow keys or wasd and to me arrow keys are also whack because most things use a mouse unless it doesn't use a mouse then fine that's another reason I hated uh, emulators because I was so young that I didn't really know how to change the change the the keybinds. Um, so I was like I and I remember on my old laptop the down um, arrow key the button the the key cap came off. Um, so like I just, I just hated it. Yeah. Getting someone to build a castle that sounds awful. I'm different because I've been playing. Bethesda games on my computer for a long time with the same controls. Blasphemy. <laughs> Keep replying to me and asking questions to my questions. I'm sorry. That's how I'm used to talking to chat. Even though I literally said I'm, I think it's pointless for me to ask right now given that you're trying to go to work. Literally the only reason you think WASD isn't obscenely stupid is because it's what you're trained on. Let me ask you a question. How many keys does your pinky have access to when you use WASD? I agree, but also my pinky wouldn't have, like, if I use, like, ESDF or whatever, my pinky wouldn't have, I, I have a short pinky. I already can't, I already don't use control. I can't use control because it's, it's too, it's too low. So, I, I don't know, man. That's why I always get rid of control as a, as a key bind. Because I can't reach it. My pinky's too small. Can I select multiple items? Oh my god, I can. What am I doing? All this time. Freakishly tiny digit has nothing to do with this conversation. 
Well, it's not that. Basically, Minecraft, we beat the dragon on Sunday. So now we're building and getting ready for the wither. Okay. Why? What do you mean building and getting ready for the wither? The wither is so easy. You just go underground, build a cave that he can barely move around in. Control is stupid. Typically, when I play games, I don't need to be pressing eight different buttons at the same time. Exactly. Also, WASD makes sense to me because I get lost on my controls a lot. Like, my hands get lost on the controls. So, WASD is always really easy because it's the far left of the keyboard. Unless they do something with, like, I don't know, F or J where it has the bumps on it. Then I just, I think WASD is smarter. Use ESDF. Our God help us. R D F G. You have a dozen kids to hit with your pinky. All right. I, I'm not, unless you're playing MMOs, do I really need to hit a thousand different keys? Because eight buttons is the proper amount that we're talking about. Not building for the wither, just building whatever you want. Fun. Why do you need a half dozen different buttons with your pinky? <laughs> God, Yonder, you're kind of, you're kind of in the minority here right now. Hi, Tizzerall. I'm surprised you're still here. Cool. We got more stuff. Give me my coins. I'm gonna be so rich after this. We're gonna get our cabin. Exciting. Exciting. I kind of feel bad selling those other things before donating. Fuck okay, MMOs. Unless you're playing games um, that have controls that aren't incredibly simple. Porto, why are you supporting Yonder, huh? Tezzero, why? Why are you like this? I fully understand I'm in the minority. Logic usually is. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me right now? With that bullshit? Really? We got 10 grand, baby. I do. Because he's fun and nice. Am I not fun and nice? She's the fourth person that, uh, who's right. Yeah, Yonder, are you go are you actively going in to games that use WASD and swapping it to like RDFG or whatever the fuck? Are you actively doing that? Also, it works out with with the the placement of my mic. I purposely place it where really only thing is left is like WASD in the in the um on the left. And then, like, my, my numbers and stuff on the right and enter. Like, left, right, lead, left, lead, right, crouch, go prone. Hey, when you're doing all that stuff, when you're doing all that stuff, just use one of these. They're literally made to do all that shit. When you're playing games like this, like what I like to play, WASD works well. I'm changing to the key mind since before WASD existed. Too tired, but I love your streams. Well, Minecraft streams. Damn. He doesn't like- he only likes Minecraft streams. Rest in peace. Any other games? I'll use it with WSD placement though. Yes, you can! Exactly! You can! Do you play on Xbox? I do not. I don't even own an Xbox. Well, my boyfriend does, but I don't. I fully love controls. Except when aiming is required. Oh my god. I'm gonna just- I'm gonna just move on from this nonsense conversation, honestly. It feels useless. For you to show me what that comp thing- the controls I'm sure I could do it if I was able to successfully play MMOs and shit with crazy ass combos I could do it I could do it bro let's upgrade my tent to a cabin yes okay I'll upgrade your tent now are we gonna be an actual tent now oh not really okay that's still really sad okay Tezreal when people respect the streamer. Since <laughs> you quit talking about MMOs, we moved on. I used to love MMOs, so I can I can talk about it all I want. It's my stream, bro. My stream. We got a new thing. There goes all my coins also. I, oh, no, I still have a shit ton. I thought I just lost all my money. Do I have decorations in my inventory? I mean, I have a table. Um, let's move this, pick up, and I'm gonna pick up this flower pot, pick up, and we're gonna put the table here by the, by this, also is there a quick button for this? I can't seem to find it, if there is place here. 
And then we're gonna place a table. Excuse me? This doesn't look like a table to me. Well, whatever. I guess we can still put the chair here. Hi, Rush! She wants to talk about it. Respect the streamer. <laughs> Dee is throwing her own rules. My respect, Dee Dee. My respect. <laughs> Oh, I got another another thing. Okay, I'm gonna put that back in the in the storage. Um, what are you? Common log cabin antique. Um, okay, I guess I'll put it. I don't know here. Place here. Oh, it's big. Oh, oh, it's a phone booth. Oh, that's kind of cute. Well, let's put the flowers right next to it. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no. Flowers go right here. Flowers place here. Beautiful. Adorable. How you doing, bud? Let me pet you. I'll have your food tomorrow. Apparently it comes in like seven hours. Dislikes imp. Seems kind of harsh, my dude. Uh, okay, and then I want to plant this tree. Where do we want to plant this tree? I'll plant it right here. Here's what looks, like, looks like a good spot. Place here. Oh, no, is it out of the light? Is it not? Okay, we're still good. I'll say, is it not going to grow because it's out of the light? It's fine. Okay, now let's go sell all this stuff. And I want to see if I can craft any, any new cool house items. Let's stick around. All right, Tizzerel. You're good. You can do whatever you'd like, dude. Whatever you want to do. I would like to craft something. I want to craft this, but I don't know how to get charred fish bones. I also don't know how to get iron ingus. So I wouldn't mind to craft that as well. Oh, right here. Wait, that's a silver ingot. How do we get iron ingots, though? Oh, donate to collections for reward. Uh, yes. I will be donating this. Crafted. Cool, cool, cool. Excuse me, can you go away please? Thank you. Um, oh, I need five of these. Okay, so let's craft four more. Can I just, can I not type in? All right, I guess I can't type in. Craft four more. Have a good stream head on my head out. Okay, Rush, have a good night. Thanks for dropping by. Thanks for hanging out. For my, my little indie game. Thank you all for hanging out for my little indie game. I'm so used to people not giving a shit about it. Bet. Why are we saying, why are we betting? Um, I think that's it for now as far as donating to collections. Well, let's craft one more of these so I can have one of those to donate as well. Cool. Cool, cool. Uh, do you want a hug? Yeah, let's give a hug. Cute. What a way I can... Can I learn you something from the olden days of how stupid key configs were? Sure. What's up? What's up, sir? Uh, I want to sell stuff. Let's sell you and you. What are you? No, I don't want to sell those. I think I'll actually be able to use those. Not that. Um, okay, I think I'm just going to sell these for now. Uh, no, I want to keep the potatoes. That's great. Here you go. Cool. Oh, I want to buy new clothes, too. I want a new look. Oh, okay. That's not what I want to do. I think my character looks cute. I want to buy clothes. Let's do that. Yes. Too cute. Yes, please. Adorable. Obsessed. I love it. Okay, now let's go donate. Maybe we'll fish a little bit more, too, in case I see. Um, wait, can I shake this? Yes, please. Gimme. Uh, I should check out and see if there's any other trees over here that I can shake. Ah, oh, these look like they'd be from um, Princess Mononoke. Any other Studio Ghibli fans? Typing a serious... Uh, sending us a delay. What do you mean? He... 
probably because of my dog water Wi-Fi. <laughs> yeah, that's probably a huge delay. I'm sorry. Okay, way back in the day, we used the middle of the keyword because we were wise. Bard's Tale, for example, I used use IJKM, literally nothing else, and the games they used mouth and keyboard were birthed. And so some not wise people presumed that that meant we needed our hands next to each other the same way that we have when we type, so we use mouse. And the numpad. That seems awful. Like, this seems... And I do have boobs, so it makes it harder. But this seems awkward and terrible. That's not how your hands are when you type. Your, your hands are in the middle of the keyboard when you type. So that makes sense to have them next to each other. Not have one hand on the far side of the, of the keyboard. And then also have the other hand right next to it on the far side of the keyboard. That makes zero sense. Wait, you have boobs? I know. Crazy, right? It's pretty whack, right? I want to do something with these little animal guys. They're pretty damn cute. Why you keep get I keep getting the same exact fish. Give me something new. Well, we moved the keyboard. We weren't that stupid. Yeah, but then you have to move the keyboard. So when you want to type, you have to move back. No, then there's. You know how there are no kangaroos in Canada? I mean, I'm assuming so, given that it's such it's cold. So we didn't think we had our hands not next to each other. Numpad was horrible. Yeah. I mean, it seems like it would be horrible. Can I collect anything over here? Hello, cute little spirit dudes. But I, well, I was almost attacked by one. Were you at like a zoo or something? Did it get loose? Was it a pet or something? We weren't that stupid. I know you weren't, but I'm just saying like, well, okay, clearly you were because someone from that generation did have to design it to have that, those, those, uh, controls. But I'm saying, like, it's dumb that you have to move your keyboard when you're playing games versus typing. Just on the res. Uh, I, that's gotta be escaped or something. Like, that doesn't seem like it'd be a normal thing to just find out casually Brian, I see boobs in chat what did I miss oh um yonder was talking about how people used to use the numpad as a as a like WASD like what for movement and stuff and I'm talking about how this is so uncomfortable it's like golfing like I don't know how women golf or like back when I used to play baseball or softball it's like any movement where you have to do this with your arms is so uncomfortable was on skinwalker or it was a skinwalker yeah that honestly would make more sense than just a like random freaking wild kangaroo in canada it seems way too cold back then games are played by generation that is younger than the generation who made the game that i don't know if that's necessarily true i mean someone had to had a test play that game and i'm assuming it's from that generation that made it Can I actually get this fish, or is it going to be too close to the... I'm just going to have to make a turn around, aren't I? Oh, so close. Perfect. The game companies weren't big enough to hire people just to test games. I think they were big enough to have the people making the games test the games. That's what I mean. They're, that's literally what I just said. And the people who made the games you just said are part of the older generation. You're literally nullifying your own point, bro. I'm native. You're native to Canada? Can you be native to Canada? Or is it like... Like America, where the actual native peoples are not who the people who are saying that they're native. So she looks exactly like Animal Crossing? Yes. A lot of this look, looks exactly like Animal Crossing. So like in the game older than the audience are making the games for. Yes, but that's not what you said. Alright, I keep getting the same old fucking fish. Today, Azini learns what First Nations mean. Ooh, I didn't even know I could donate the bird. Wait, wait, I want to donate everything all at once. So I'm not doing this all over again. Donates. Sounds good. Here you go. 
Long nose, lung. Ling, not lung. Can we get a ruling from the moderator, please? Thank you. It'll be native to an area you were born in there, no? What do you make a ruling for the from the moderator? What are we what is she ruling on? We have a mod here? Yeah, Porto's mod. She's just playing Minecraft. Um I don't I don't know how native works with what in that sense. I do not. I like awkward because it was a bigger than average size. <laughs> average chest things yes i know they are we don't need to talk about that we don't need to talk about how i get cut i have to get like custom ass bras to actually fit me do you have an eye on chat you're all good for now going to agree the games are played by the generation that is younger than the generation who made the game that is that is what i said i mean the generation that also made the game plays it that's what i mean why yonder why why Alright, let's sell some of this stuff and let's also dump some stuff in my inventory. I want to grab all these shelves because they make me so much money. Not always true though. What about the, the game developing thing? You don't know. This isn't even- I'm not well informed on this argument enough to, to, to be able to have it. Also, it's getting a little exhausting, not gonna lie. Not a word, just an ass bra. I mean, you're not wrong, but usually bras give support. Um, check 2.45 in the stream and cry. But yeah, bras usually give support, so if it was, if underwear was a bra for an ass, then I feel like it would be, um, oh, I think I haven't donated this yet. I'm going to hold off on that. Um, then I feel like it would have to give, uh, more support for your ass. Exhausting is my cue. I'm 4'2", people, I'm, for real? What? Or 4'20". Do you want to use good support? I'd say no. I'd say no. Ooh, I learned a new cooking recipe. Ooh. Noble jewel crafting recipe. Pretty cool. Pretty cool, pretty cool. All right. Uh, excuse me, sir. There are no games for old people or do old people not play games? I think there's, there's, there's games for old people, but also I don't think games are necessarily have to be for a specific age group. So honestly, I feel like it's a mixture of both. Okay, can I dump some stuff? Stuff in my storage. Yes. Let's just add a bunch of stuff that I don't. Hmm. What? Why? Why is it like randomly not letting me click it? Put in storage. Yes. And also put this in storage. Alright. Cool. What we got? Down here. Materialist, beginner. Sweet, sweet. Oh, he's so cute. Pac-Man is what old people would play. Or Candy Crush. <laughs> yes, Candy. God, old people, I'm sorry, Yonder. They love their mobile games. They really do. The answer to my question is yes. That means Yonder is wrong because it was proposed. Um, and you the games are played by the generation that is younger than the generation who made the game. Or you disagree that there are no old people games and that we don't play games. <laughs> we play more games, better games than others. Yonder, this is just, you're just making this into a generational argument and that's not, that's not necessary. But no, no. Let's suggest that there are no examples of people older than the game devs playing said games. Well, which games? I wouldn't necessarily say that. Because it's games developed by younger people. And then older people than them are playing it. I don't think that's necessarily true. Okay. My oh, sister wasn't in the full of the discussion. Neither is mine, Porto. I'm missing a lot here. The one who's making about generations started that way. 
Can I have a recap, please? No, because I don't think I could even physically give a recap. I'm at a loss here, too. Okay. Now, I know we've had fun, but I officially have nothing left to do in this game for today because it's like a daily thing. So, I think I'm going to head off. Um, play COD, MC. M I don't know what MK is. Roblox, not Fortnite, though. What is MK? Simple Yonder. I'm not bullying him. Not starving. I'm just quoting you. Damn. Yeah, Yonder, he's just using what you do against him. I'm going to see if there's any people playing Cozy Grove, and I'm going to read them. Cozy Grove. Uh. Oh, there's not many people playing this. Surprisingly. Um, we're actually going to read the stream that's right, right below us in views, if that's all right, if we're all good with that. Uh, raid view. All right, we gotta, we gotta wrap up the argument, boys. We gotta wrap it up. Okay, bye. Great funsy, much love. Not you, the chat. Mortal Kombat. Oh, yes, yes, Mortal Kombat. All people play games designed by the generation who die. <laughs> go back to the beginning of time. I would say it doesn't go back to the beginning of time. I think that's a little extreme. Are you saying that old people don't play games that are younger than they are? Okay, well, bye. See you next time. Remember me. I will always remember you, Tesserol. Don't worry. I will. I will. Don't, don't you worry, sir. All right. Only, only eight out of the 11 of you want to raid? That's all right. Okay. Well, um... Thank you all for hanging out. It was much fun. I really like this game. It is very much a casual game. You guys just argue the entire time, so it made me a little stressed out, <laughs> but I'm just kidding. Um, okay, I hope... How do you want to raid? Oh, please! I want to I wanna have my viewers do the whole raid, Zyde raid, ZD raid. I want you guys to do it. I want you guys to do it so fucking bad. Spam my emotes. Do it, please. I want that so bad. Please. Okay. I'm gonna actually go to get out and like go to bed soon here, um, cause the raid's about to go up. Okay, I hope everyone has a good night, morning, evening, whatever time zone you are in. Good, bye, goodbye, goodbye. A drum drop master? This is the guy you chose for. <laughs> he, there was only three other people playing the game, babe. That's